Alright, um... I think I need to restart the game now. I'm pretty sure I need to start a new game. Because... I guess having incomplete testament doesn't affect an ending. So it's the four endings from the from the characters that that um from like the love interests. Uh then one ending or will it be an ending though? I guess one ending might have to do with the golden maidens. Either way, I have to restart. So I'm actually gonna... I'm gonna go for Lebkuhen's route. Um... To this run. Couldn't sleep much last night, could you? Could you? Couldn't sleep a wink. Explains the hilarity. You're hopeless, Lebkuhen. As long as you keep indulging me. So it's my fault, huh? Here you go, before I forget. Oh. You sure know how to get to a lady's heart. Oh, you brought me my favorite. Mr. Bernhard said you were rather late getting home last night. Is that so? I did tell you it was almost time for supper when you stopped by. And I told you Miss Alma worked me like a donkey right up until nightfall. Mr. Bernhard was fretting, fretting over you is all. Mr. Bernhard... Uh, Mr. Bernhard can find better things to do with his time, I'm certain. You really are so stubborn, Elisa. Anyhow, it's about time I head out. Say, I'll be up at the bell tower all afternoon if you'd like to keep me company. I'll be there, Leb. There she is. Spend some time with her. You'll start to grow roots standing there all day, Deb Kuhan. <laughs> Why, I'd make for a rather pretty flower, don't you think? Oh wait, I did see this, didn't I? For goodness sake. <laughs> a little cheery for this time of day, don't you think? You're the one who's an eventful day, Adisa. Too eventful for my taste, even. Mm -hmm. There's plenty to tell me about then, isn't there? Why, I think not. I came here to spend time with you, Leb. It is a... Now sit. <laughs> sit. Right there. Sit. Sit. Now this is what I came here for. <laughs> Beat standing, wouldn't you say? I spoil you a little too much, I say. Not like I have it any other way, anyhow. You're, tell you're telling me all about it later, Elisa. About those shoes and about that lass. Alright, alright. Not one more word about this nonsense now, you hear? Fine. Still, Elisa, I thought you knew. Knew what? About what happened earlier today. Oh, it's probably best I tell you about it later. <laughs> to think you're a proper nun. More like an imp. <laughs> you're truly so easy to tease, Elisa. For goodness sake. Don't tell him you don't want to, Leb. There's nothing to tell, Elisa. I know you love Kuhan, but I won't force you. You can tell me when you're ready. Whenever that is. Well, I'll be waiting for you by the fountain tomorrow afternoon, so... Don't be late, Elisa. Why can't she be honest with me? It's making me more frustrated than it should. Ah! Fuck! I need to reset. Easier not, Leb. You better not be hiding anything from me. 
You get to keep secrets, yet I don't. So there is something. I wouldn't say I'm keeping it from you, but... You'll think I'm untrusting it, Isa. What? You see, I've been thinking about you. All of Kifferberg knows you won't stay here forever. Will you? That's a different issue altogether, Elisa. Seems to me they're quite the same, if I'm honest. Be that as it may, what am I to do when you're gone, Elisa? You're... how to put it... You're only comforted in this dull place? You're also very much irritating, like an imp, I'd say. Am I now? Terribly so. Didn't think I could read you this easily, did you? My, I might just throw you in the well at this rate. I might drown, Leb. Then you'd really be left without me. I'm, le I'm well aware, Leb Kuhin. You're not the only one who thinks fondly of what we have, but... But? It doesn't mean we can't be together someplace else, does it? You hadn't thought of it like that, had you? Anyhow... I'll be waiting for you by the fountain tomorrow afternoon. Don't be late, Elisa. For goodness sake. There she is. I'll spend some time with her. Alright, that was a bit love, Kuhan. My, aren't you keen at either? It's no use mocking me, Leb. What happened? Today has been rather pushing, that's all. It's no use giving me a half-hearted answer, either. Promise me you won't make too much of it, Elisa. I promise I won't make too much of it, Leb Kuhan. I'm serious. So am I. I got into a, into a bit of an altercation with old Yochen earlier. An altercation? You? Why, I'm allowed to lose my temper every once in a while, I'd say. Alright, well... What did, what did the old folks... What did the old fool do? Accused Miss Lisbeth, Miss Lisbeth of witchery right in front of the children, and I... May or may not have called in an ill-bred old fool. Either way, Father Han sent me back to cleaning duty in church, and apparently I'm meant to apologize to old Yochen sometime, too. Why that old donkey? That's ridiculous. You promised you wouldn't make too much of it, Elisa. See yourself, then? Yet I ought to. Since you won't let Kuhan, what choice do I have? It's my duty, that's all there is to it. Which we both know you loathe. You more so than I, even. I don't loathe it, Elisa. I have just realized it may not be what I want for myself. What is it you want, then? I don't know yet. Liar. Can you tell? You frown when you lie. And your brows twitch. You, you don't look me in the eye and you're... <laughs> it's cold, Leb. Stop it. <laughs> it's time someone taught you a lesson, Lisa. What lesson, Leb mm -hmm. To keep your promises, Lisa. I told you not to make a fuss, so this is what you get. <laughs> You're soaking me like Lev Kuhin. <laughs> Repent for your sins, Elisa. Trust me, I'm a clergy woman. <laughs> Why, you... That's enough, Lev Kuhin. 
As for you, Elisa, you fiddle with your brooch when you lie. For goodness sake, how is that relevant? Just reminding you that I can read you too. Aren't you clever, you little? It's best we move along now. I have floors to scrub. I suppose you do. I'll wait for you by the bakery tomorrow afternoon. If you'd like to... Loiter about with you again tomorrow, you say? Let's get going and I'll see you later tonight. And tomorrow too. Tomorrow too, huh? Wait. Oh, no, never mind. There she is. Alright, I'll spend some time with her. I'm all ears, Elisa, but make it quick. You're not making this any easier, are you? I wouldn't say it's supposed to be easy, Elisa. Lebekuhen, I am... I'm truly sorry about what happened yesterday. For all the trouble you went through afterward, too. That's alright, Elisa, I forgive you. Huh? More importantly, won't you lend me a hand? On the swing, I mean. Not being fair, you're too stubborn. You're too stubborn. I regret all that happened yesterday. I know you do, Elisa, but it's not... I think I'll be heading back to work. Fuck. Alright. I'll keep out for your hair tomorrow. Uh, I'll keep out of your hair from now on. You can trust me, Elisa. I know, but not this time, love. Fuck. Not with this. I'll be seeing you about town. Damn it! That was the worst possible answer. Alright. You're not being fair, love. Why won't you let me apologize? Why, haven't you already? Properly, Lev Kuhen. You can't just say you forgive me. My, I'm fairly certain I can, Lisa. I haven't even done anything to... You keep... You keeping me company every day is more than enough, I'd say. <laughs> Come now, give me a push, will you? You're truly... Push harder, Lisa. I'll make it up to you, Lev. I promise I will. Do you remember what you did to my shoes that time, Elisa? Oh, don't start with those stories. <laughs> Using old Wilhelm's saw to take out the heels. I thought they were hurting you all... Wait. I thought they were hurting you. All you ever did was stand all day. <laughs> or that night you broke my bedroom window with a rock. I was trying to call you outside, Lev. You also hid my veils. Uh, inhabits in the abandoned house once. I never liked you having to wear all that nonsense. That's true, you never did. Oh, remember that one time you... I remember it all, Lev Kuhen. Quit embarrassing me. That's why I'm so upset, Lev. All I ever seem to do is get you in trouble. That's true. You've always... You've always been a bit of a nuisance. Took you long enough to... I wouldn't have it any other way. I care about you, Elise. You know that by now. I know that, but... Come now. I've been telling you that I... I care about you just as much, Chilep Kuhin. What's there to get flustered about you? Say, I'll be home tomorrow morning to lend a hand. I'll be there, Leb. <laughs> Alright, but you can't steal all the, f all, all the filling again. 
I was six years old, Labkuhen. Wait, right there, you. Oh, wait, 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 this is different. The woodland, this grove, it's aching. Lev Kuhen, your flesh, your blood, your love. All that's rightfully mine, my progeny. This thing's not Lev Kuhen. I can give you all that you desire. What? My beloved daughter. What are you? This last, Lev Kuhen. Is she the one your heart desires? What are you? They're coming. We will meet again. Wait, so what the fuck is Apple gonna think? I actually... I actually started, um... I started subtitling like the old Rony Kenshin anime. So I make them like new subs. Um, fine. don't you start, Elisa? What are you thinking? You couldn't. It doesn't matter, Elisa. I'll be out and about after lunch anyhow. Granny Gretel's preparing it for me, so you can. I'm not going anywhere, Lev Kuhen, and neither are you. Not until I've given you a proper earful. My, I'm jumping for joy. You're impossible to put up with when you get like this. How would you like me to be feeling? Angry, of course. Or try my patience. Uh, angry. You're being taken for granted like you always are. Tell me something I don't know. That includes you, Leb Kuhen. I'm sorry, Leb. I didn't come here to let, yell at you, but I, but I still don't understand. Why don't you... Why do you break your back for these folks? It's my duty, Elisa. You're well aware I don't appreciate being lied to, Lev Kuhen. Neither do I. Yet, that's what you've been doing all week. I don't know how to let go, Elisa. That's all. Well, holidays you celebrate just like, like, mostly just Halloween and Christmas and my birthday. Though, I, I kind of stopped celebrating those. I mean, I don't really celebrate Halloween, I'm too old for that. I don't know uh, how to let go, Lisa, that's all. Let go of what? Of who I am here in Kieferberg. Of this duty and purpose. I'm well aware I'm being taken for granted. And I take myself for granted too, trying my own patience. What do you mean, trying your own patience? I'm not certain I have any faith left, left in me, Elisa. You mean... I'm a hypocrite, Elisa. Praying for folks when I no longer... You're far from a hypocrite, Lev Kuhen. You're kind, you're dedicated, you're a rock for these folks. Whether that's true or not, Elisa, I feel trapped. The same way you do, only with other obligations and... And? In other ways as well. I'm torn between my duty and my... Feelings. What do you mean? What kind of feelings? It doesn't matter, Elisa. It's not as though you... Oh, to hell with you, Debakuhan. I've had it with this nonsense. Be it your feelings or your lack of faith, or what have you. You're done working yourself into the ground and that's final. You know it's not that easy, Elisa. I also know overcompensating, overcompensating won't fix it, Debakuhan. You frightened me, for goodness sake. 
I'm sorry. No more of that now. You need to get some rest. Alright. Also, about these feelings of yours. There's nothing to fear, Leb. Not when it comes to me, alright? I'll come... Yeah, I'll come about tomorrow morning to spend time with you, alright? Alright, I'll be waiting. Wait, why is it pink? Wasn't it blue? Camera reminds me of Disco Elysium. I need to play that. Uh, truth or dare? Uh, I don't know how many dares I can do, but sure. Um... That game just invaded my brain since I've played that. Hmm, I should play it sometime. What are you doing out here in the rain, like, Kuhen? My, you sure like nagging me, don't you, Ariza? I have good reason to fret you. Mm -hmm. Oh, don't worry. Oh, don't you worry about me. What if you collapse again, or... Come now, I have something to tell you, Ariza. Wait, Lev Kuhan. You can tell me all about it in your room, whatever it is. My, aren't you cheeky, Ariza? That's not what I... I just thought we could come here for old times' sake is all. For goodness sake. This is this a horror game, by the way? Yep. This Coliseum is the best game I've played hands down. I highly recommend it. Ooh. Hmm. I'll try it one day. Maybe. I don't know if I'll try it on stream because it might be too much for my computer. For goodness sake. It hasn't changed at all, has it? To think we'd spend the entire afternoon cooped up in there. Don't you remember planning to spend an, uh, the night that time? Aha, yeah. uh -huh, now that you mention it. You were going to bring the day's leftovers for supper, right? I was in charge of the blankets, and we even swept the floors. I don't see the horror. Uh, yeah, it's not yet a horror game. Yeah, there, there are certain parts that are a horror game. There are certain parts where it's a dating sim. <laughs> yeah, I feel that. It takes a fair bit of PC resources, though not much compared to current AAA games. Mm. Our granny's faces when they found out too still give me still gives me the shivers. <laughs> Oh, like DDLC? Yeah, kind of like DDLC. Anyhow, what was it you wanted to tell me? Leb? This usually is not part of the horror. <laughs> it is a... Most of this house, it is a... Give me your soul. Uh, give me your soul, Elisa. I'll haunt you forever. <laughs> Good timing. Yeah, that, that one was perfect timing. I was not. I did not think that was that would. This was gonna happen. That's not funny, you. <laughs> Why? But I'm the silliest ghost around. <laughs> Enough of that, Lev Kuhan. You nearly sent me to my grave. Just as easy to frighten it, Isa. Why, thank you for reminding me. I do come here often, in truth. Hashtag... Poor hashtag? Uh... What? 
Everything used to be easier back then, didn't it? Anyhow, lab. Not so certain. Anyhow. Maybe it's best you go inside and rest, wouldn't you say? Shh. Yeah. You'd say so? This other can't be good for you, is all. I see. Perhaps that would be better, yes. Fuck! Everything's quite the same, Leb. We just got older. Kieferberg hasn't changed, that's true. Isn't it time you tell me what's on your mind? You see, Ediza. Uh... I like how Japanese devs, mangakas, and anime directors often use folklore of different countries in their works. Yeah. Collapsing yesterday has made me come to terms with it. With what? I've been hiding all this time, you see. Hiding behind Kieferberg. Behind this veil. Behind you, even. Might try to get Zeke to join. Wonder if she can say about this. Uh, she might know a fair bit about German folklore. Ooh. Who? To join the stream chat. Ooh. Yeah, sure. Uh, all the help I can get, really. <laughs> I've used my duty to stay as I am for the sake of the townspeople, and... I've used you as an excuse to stay here in Kieferberg. Are you afraid I'll leave you behind? I am, partly. But I expected to overcome this fear tomorrow. I'm kinda lagging. Are you? I think I've discovered you through her stream chat. Wait, I have. Wait. Huh? Wait, I... Hold on, who? Hold on. Let me... <laughs> who the hell did I... I was in her chat... In her chat? Wow, why do I not remember the people that I was in chat with? <laughs> I may be mis misremembering things. I'm fine now, but I liked a bit before. Oh. Oh, it did? Shit. Uh, I am part- Wait, what, what did I say? Uh, are you afraid I'll leave you behind? I am partly, but I expect to overcome this fear tomorrow. Tomorrow? With or without you, Elisa, it's time to make my own decisions. Why wait until tomorrow, Lev? Why not tell me now? <laughs> Something tells me tomorrow will be different, that's all. Uh, so it might be a different streamer I found you with? Oh. Maybe. You're truly... Come, let's move along. I've kept you for long enough. I have something to, to tell you tomorrow, too. Oh, is that so? It truly is so, you. Somebody help me, the ghost is back. Why, you? Wait right there. Why did it turn pink? It used to be blue. Because it was... Because this time, Apfel didn't see Rosemarine in the forest. He saw Lev Kuhen. Brethren, I've gathered you here today to address the recent goings-on. You're rather late, father. We've had enough. Show some respect, Alma. No, she's right. We need answers, father. I'm afraid we will not be getting many today, Guido. Also, let me know if the stream is lagging. Because, like, it does- it's not lagging, like, on me, because I'm looking at the stream on my phone. If this is yet yeah, another plea for us to overlook the situation... Why don't we let Father Hans take the lead? He said it- Yeah. He's had it all week. And look where it got us, Gustav. 
We're together here this evening for a, for a vigil, brethren. Together we're to appeal... Eh. Together we are to appeal to the Lord's mercy and benevolence. As well as... All that'll do is just put a lid on folks. Eh. All that'll do is just put a lid on folks' troubles, Father. That's right. We need this witch to pay. Gave out a call for all the Germans I know to join the stream and share their knowledge on the German folklore. Oh. You didn't need to do... <laughs> Wait. Uh... Thank you. <laughs> Who would you suggest ought to pay, Lorelei? Where's this witchy folk speak of? Gustav's right. We don't know where to turn. It's like four or five people, don't worry. Oh, okay. Or should I not have done that? Um... I mean... It's, it's, it's fine if you do. Like, it helps me, really. So, you know, that's a good thing. Um... But, like... I wouldn't want, like, you telling them to, like, join the stream and then, like, you know, them, like, you know, kind of thinking that, like, it was me that told you to do it. Or, like, that, um, or that, you know, uh, or maybe, like, you know, they're there, like, th don't want to be there, you know? Uh, but no, it's fine, but if, if it's not like that, but, you know, but yeah, if, but yeah. Thank you. It, it helps me, but... Yeah. Just... No, it's gonna be fine? Alright, alright. I trust you. Prayer will show us the path we ought to follow, brethren. Why, I prayed all day and... Uh, I prayed all day, every day, and nothing's changed, Father. I fear for my poor Jacob, Father. I, uh, welcome back, Bear, Me Bear Memes. Stream Elements is, uh... I really need to take that thing out of, out of chat. Uh, you might not want to write in all caps because Stream Elements will act up again. Whoever is out there, they're taking our children, compromising our livelihoods. It's a decision folks want, Hans. We ought to search every last in town for the witch's mark. We share things like uh, such streamers we like often in the server. I message them about you so they aren't gonna, uh, gonna think I'm like shining for you. Ah, oh, okay, 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 okay. All right. We ought to do no such thing, you old geezer. That's no way to address your elders, Elisa. Perhaps if my elders hadn't completely lost their wits. Rest assured, Elisa, no lasting Kieferberg will be searched, older, young or old. You fools still resist what must be done. Old Yochen's right. We must see this through. Are you going to do it then, Mr. Ludwig? If there's anyone who ought to do this, it's Lev Kuhan. Me, Miss Brunhilde? Of course, lass. You're a woman of God. Woman of God or not, Lev Kuhan is to be searched as well. None of you are touching her. Still, Elise, we ought to search someone. It may be for the best, Elise. Are you searching Freya too, then? And Miss Elizabeth? No exceptions, lass. Truth is, we don't know anything about your cousin, Elisa. Why don't we start with her? That's right. This all started the day she got here. No, I haven't done anything. Nobody's laying a finger on her. I saw her. I saw the witch. I saw that Kuhan in the woods. Uh, and it also seemed like none of them have woken up yet. Uh, 
Yeah, isn't it like 6? Well, almost 7 a.m. for them. In Germany, at least. I love the different color palette. Yeah, but... Mm -hmm. It's still lagging? It's not lagging for me, though. That's the thing. Like, I think that's... Hey, Capo, is the stream lagging? Just... Because, like, I'm looking at the stream on my phone, but it's not... Like, it's not lagging. And OBS says it's fine. I forgot it's 7 a.m. for them. Not for me. Yeah. My beloved daughter. Elisa saw her too. She talked to the witch. There it is, folks. There are the witches. Oh, Apfel. So it was true, Elisa. You and Neb Kuhan are the ones who've been making our lives hell. No. What are you insinuating? Confess a lot of you. Confess to your sins, you wretched witches. Did you or did you not meet Leb Kuhan in the woods, Arisa? Of course I didn't. Uh, it's daytime for me? Hmm. So it seems like something's wrong in your hand, Bear. Have you already tried refreshing the page? I'm on phone. Uh, you can still refresh the stream by, like, closing the stream and reopening it. I was all by myself, right until I found him. Why? The lad says he saw you to it, Issa. I didn't mean that. Uh, I didn't meet anyone in the woods, I swear. Oh my goodness, look. It's the witch. The witch is here. Oh, we're all going to die. We must keep calm, folks. Keep calm. Didn't work in the past? Well, it can work now. And now, too. Oh, okay, never mind. The faucet breaks. Must be the witch. <laughs> to be fair, um, if, uh, if you interact with it uh, prior to the game, it says that no water has has uh, come out of that faucet in quite some time, so... I guess there's a reason to be afraid of it. She was there. I saw her. She had yellow eyes. What do you have to say for yourself, lass? But I was right here that evening. That's true. You were consoling me right until they made it back, but... I saw you, Lev Kuhan. No, Apfel, I don't think you did. Uh, don't be ridiculous, Apfel. You can't be serious, Apfel. Oh, I wouldn't want to believe such a thing. Elisa has always been a bad influence on the poor lass, after all. Of all folks who betrayed Kieferberg, Leb Kuhan. I didn't. You all know she couldn't do it. Leb Kuhan isn't involved in any of it. Yet the lad says otherwise. You two men in the woods, Elise. You're both involved. Don't be ridiculous. I was in Kipperberg all day. You seriously abusing... He's just a boy. Haven't you had enough of this foolery, you? Far from it, Elisa. Everything's suddenly becoming clear. Listen to yourselves. I've heard enough. I won't stand for... Search them both. We must search them right now. Find the witch's mark. I will take no more of this nonsense. This is enough. Can't you see what you're doing to Kieferberg? Can't you see this witch nonsense is turning us against each other? The witch is clearly right here in Kieferberg, lass. 
Nobody in Kieferberg could ever do such a thing, old Yochan. We're a family, all of Kieferberg, no exceptions. Although we all understand your feelings, Freya. You clearly don't, father. Nobody does. Avfeld believes he's seen the witch. Folks have been on edge all day. All of this is a consequence of how we've been facing this crisis. With fear, hostility, and hesitation. That's all very nice, Freya, but we need to do something. Okay, I was missing the context? Yeah. Let's do the vigil then. Work on the preparations for the festival together. Like the family we are. The family we've always been. Bit weird to hear the Japanese voiceover not matching up the dialogue. Although I like... I know like 10 words from Japanese. Might be wrong. Uh, no. Some of them don't actually match up with the dialogue. Like I think... <laughs> In, cer in certain scenes, Erisa just says, like, at this rate, they're gonna eat me, but, like, the that's not what the dialogue says in the box. It's just the voice line that says that. Like, the family we are. The family we've always been. Freya. Would you folks truly burn me at the stake? Or Elise, Lev Kuhin, even Rosa and Marina? I expected more from my family, that's all I wanted to say. Gonna need a power nap, so I'll be right back later. Alright, have a good night. You said more than enough, Freya. All of Kieferberg is... Uh, yeah, all of Kieferberg is to meet here tonight for prayer. Sleep well and powerfully. Yep. As we ought to have done from the start. Hmm. Move along now, folks. We have to focus on what we ought to do. Protect our yeah, protect our home at all costs. And well, yeah. Yeah, it is certainly like JoJo, yeah. Uh I don't remember the order of these, if I'm being completely honest. Wait. That was that good. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Usually that would be, um, Rose and Marina, so I guess, yeah, it depends on the... on the route that you're taking. <laughs> was that a motherfucking... Yes, yes, I think so. Alright. Skillism has a distinct art style as well. But it's going for a different style, more expressionist. Mm. Oh. What in the... You're rather brave, lass. You. Do you yearn for wealth and fortune that deeply? I clearly do, Serpent. Now let her go. No, I don't think I will. What in the Lord's name? Is he gonna turn into Lepkuhin now? He did. Kind of. Bit of a different approach there. You know there's something you have yet to come to terms with. Something you've been avoiding. What are you talking about? The good company, lass. You sacrifice your mortal body for the tender flesh. You know it's your blood needed for the sweetest nectar. Yet, it's the good company you refuse to surrender. What are you talking about? Show me the depths of your heart. What? I wish to see how dearly you care for your beloved. Uh, which one is this? This one. I don't know how that didn't hit me. Ah, oh, there's a fucking chair. That's why. 
Uh, if you want to see a good thing, you can Google this collision skills and look at the images. They're very abstract and interesting. Uh, Uh, you got any other trick up your sleeve? You want to know how deeply I care for Leb Kuhan? He's my best friend. My bossom friend. I rely on her too much. I have to protect her. Leb Kuhan is as, uh, is as hard as I... Wait, Lev Kuhan has it as hard as I do in this place. If I could take her away... You don't know your own boss and friend, lass. You're not worth my time, let alone his. Yeah, that's a death. Um... Uh... Oh shit, I was about to ask why this game has... As heart containers when you mostly just walk around, the answer is more apparent now, <laughs> yeah. There's also those ghosts. They would have uh they would have attacked me. If um I love how they make the make the boss this thing from the background. Yeah. Well, now the answers are completely different. I hate that I can't skip this part. Oh, yeah, this is the annoying... Alright. Ah, I... The fuck? Don't... Don't, 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 eat, eat some berries, be like Mume and eat the berries. Ow. Ow. Uh, and I rely on her too much. I'm so selfish when it comes to her, but... But he just accepts it. Oh, this fucking thing. Uh oh. Yeah, my control my my controls are reversed by the way. I I can't This is simultaneously the best and worst boss in the game. I hate this part. I hate when the game fucks with your controls. Yeah. Uh, very scary. I'm such TS way of, of pausing the boss battle to jump from some snacks to heal. Yeah. <laughs> Love. It. Yeah. Um, she's the only one I care about in this rat hole of a town. Leb Kuhan is the only family I've left in this wretched village. If not for Leb Kuhan, I wouldn't... I would have left already. Yet I never did, because I don't want to lose her. And... Out. No, can you, can you please thank you? A little late, but better late than never. Uh, can I please go? Thank you. Uh, 
Uh, just notice the Christian iconography on the boss's clothes. Yeah, because uh, he's... Because uh, it's supposed to represent Nebkuhen, and usually she would be dressed as a nun, which I'm surprised that this boss isn't. I know her better than anyone, better than Granny Gretel even. I know she loves her veil. I know she hides from everyone. Lebkuhen is much more than that. And I want... I want her to give up. I want, I want her to give up. I want her to know it's alright to give up and live for her own sake. Okay. Oh, finally. Oh. Okay, before I get Lebkuhen, I'm gonna... I'm gonna get Rose and Marina um, to... Um, to the forest. It's gonna move, move along. Wait, actually. What if I know? No. Alright, never mind. How many endings does this game have? Ten. Not including uh, game overs. And I've gotten four so far, I think. This... Well, technically I'm about to get like another two or three. Yeah, okay, hold on. Yeah, yeah, yeah we know it was a marina. Hold on. Wait, actually, I forgot to... Hold on, let me... There's a snack there. That's... This. And then... Whatever the fuck. Right, that was a good company. But I, uh, that one needs to be wrong. Hold on. No, I don't want to remove anything. Uh, so I'll just put the diary entry. That'll be an interesting read, I'm sure. Can you not? Okay. Okay, hold on. Um... What the fuck am I doing? Uh... Then the flash of earthly desire. Make an offering. Yeah. I purposely chose wrong too. Um, chose the wrong, um, the wrong uh, follower because I think the ending differs. Okay, I need to eat something. I don't have anything to eat. Shit. Well, guess we're stuck with this. Not like it matters because cutscenes don't have it, so. I'm just gonna ignore them for now. Offering. Cool. Okay, and now shut up. The environment is so dreamlike. I like it so much. Uh, you'd like it more if the. 
<laughs> if the hunger thing was in there. Uh. Alright, make an offering. Alright, so that one's wrong. So what's gonna happen here? Yeah, most likely. Okay. It is it. Uh huh. Where are we? What do you mean? Are we in the woods? We've been here for a while, Rosa and Marina. The woods. Come now, Rosa and Marina. We ought to move along before. What? You've brought me here for a reason, haven't you? We've talked about this, Rosa and Marina. You're the good company. No, it is a... I told you yesterday, the good company is the object to your affections. But you are the... No, it is a... That's not it. I'm here for a reason. What are you talking about, Rosa and Marina? I was never fated to be with you as the good companion. What? I'm not the one who was destined to take you to him. You're the one who was destined... Who was destined to bring me here, Elisa. That doesn't... You brought me to the womb, Elisa. To the grove of creation my granny told me about. Our birthing place. You've brought me here to meet Walpurga, the old god. To reconnect within the old faith. Stop, Rosa and Marina. <laughs> this is my true faith, Elise. Rosa and Marina. Oh, how could I have been so foolish? Let me go, Rosa and Marina. Come with me, Elise. No, let me go. We're meant to be together, right here in her womb. No. But the filter also had the feeling of unreality of it, I guess. He's about to find out the worst she can say is no is wrong. <laughs> yeah. There's nothing to be afraid of, it is, eh? We're reaching a deeper plane of existence. Right here, in her embrace. We'll be together forever, Elise. <laughs> that gave me some shivers, yeah. <laughs> Now we get to listen to this song. This song feels so nostalgic even though it shouldn't. I like it. Yeah. It feels like the ending of like an anime that you watched like as a kid. Like when you were first getting into anime. That's what it feels like.
It's also funny that if you didn't do like one of the endings involving this, this would technically be a spoiler. <laughs> and like three animators, holy shit, yeah. I think this is the simplified credits. I haven't looked at the actual credit, but because there's two sets of credits. <laughs> one you can skip, this one you can't. There's the actual the, the other credits. Uh why can't I there you go. This one I can skip. <laughs> Become one with Rose and Marina. Ending eight, the kiss. You started out with a kiss, how did it end up like this? I'm happy to see you looking so cheery today, Ariza. Why, even I get to make merry once in a while, don't I? As though everyone's forgotten about last week, isn't it? Folks were bursting at the seams, Leb. They couldn't bear another day fretting about all that nonsense, could they? Neither could we if memory serves. Not after what happened yesterday. Is everything alright with you, Adisa? Huh? There's no need to pretend, Adisa. I know you. You've been hiding something from me, I know it. I won't ask you what it what that is, but can I trust you, Adisa? I would never do anything to betray your trust, Leb. What are you laughing about, you? I can't help it when you look so serious. Update on the Germans, they're starting to wake up. But I might not have enough power over them to drag them here. That's fine, that, that's okay. Let them wake up at least. <laughs> can't help it when you look so serious. Well, I am serious about you, Leb. Speaking of which, when you come to me to the bell... When you come with me to the bell tower... The bell tower? There is something I'd like to tell you, and I... <laughs> There's something I'd like to tell you too, Adisa. You're truly... Let's get going. You lead the way. What is it you have to tell me, Leb? I'll tell you once we're there, Elisa. I think I'm getting a bit low on emotional energy, so I'm gonna go now. I hope the stream goes well. Alright. Have uh, a good rest. Or whatever you're gonna do. <laughs> hope I can join you more often. Hey, anytime. Kiefer Briggs on Vex. Yeah. Just music is different. Kiefer Briggs unrecognizable today, isn't it? Looks quite right, the same to me, I have to say. It wasn't a joke, Lev Kuhan. I'm well aware it wasn't, Adisa. That's what I find so amusing. Amusing, you say? You're leaving soon, aren't you, Adisa? Huh? Or something along those lines, I'm certain. I don't know yet, Lev Kuhan. I'm still... Yes, you do, Arisa. I can tell. You're going to that castle, aren't you? Don't be silly, Leb Kuhen. At some level, Arisa, it's what you've always wanted. If a bird can't possibly give you any of that. What would you say I want, Leb Kuhen? More. More, huh? You've always wanted better. To go for... for Further to live more. Even when we were young, you were never truly satisfied, were you? I. Neither was I, Arisa. Huh? I told you. I never quite grew into this habit or this veil. In fact, I'm not even certain who I am without them. Alright, well. You're not, but I am, Leb. Um... 
We both know who you are without it, don't we? It's true you tend to hide. You've always been that way, but... My, how clever. You're doing it again, Levkuhan. You seriously thought I'd never notice? Not necessarily, but... You despise Father Hans, not to mention Miss Odelia. That's not... You love that dust rag of a veil and that... And that grisly habit, too. That's why you had Miss Marielle covered in frills and decorations. It's the color I'm not so... It's the color I'm not so fond of, but... You don't have a single Bible or rosary in your bedroom, let alone a cross. Even I have a silly altar, and you're the nun. That's... Quit denying it, Lebkuhen. Come now, show me your hand. We know each other better than anyone else, don't we? I don't want to be a burden to you, Arisa. That's enough hiding, wouldn't you say? I'm not... Quit holding yourself back, Lipkuhan. There's nothing left to hide. Not from me. There's still something, Arisa. Tell me then. I've been waiting, Lep. I need you to promise me something first. As long as it's a... It's not an excuse for you to... Promise me you'll be alright, with or without me. It doesn't matter. I promise, sub. I can't expect you to watch over me forever, can I? Yet, that's exactly what you'll do if I, if I let you, isn't it? Of course I will. For as long as you'll have me. You're truly... Ready to leave this rat hole of a town behind. Why, you've called it worse yourself, Adisa. Come now. There's somewhere I'd like to show you, Aleb. If it's with you, Adisa... You're so embarrassing, for goodness sake. There it is. Token of love. The good company. Kuhin's everlasting love. Is everything alright, Lisa? Ah, yes. I need a moment. I should make certain I have everything in my basket. I best hurry and get everything ready. Um, before I get everything in my... Can I... Shit. Oh. Alright, let's, uh... There you go. He'll love these festival tickets, I'm sure. Oh, wait, I start today. Uh... Hold up. Um... Wait, the, the game's just blah. Oh, th there we go.
Um, shit. Do I have anything to eat? Yes. Uh, wait, I don't have food. Wait, no. Wait, I'm soft locked. Did I just save over? No. Um, okay. Here you go, my guy. I'm sure you'll love these festival tickets. He will love them. I'm sure. Keep close to me, alright? It's best you don't wander about. We could get lost. Since when have you known about this place, Erise? Since, uh, Monday, I suppose. It's so beautiful. I've never seen so many butterflies in one place. I don't know if I'd call it beautiful, but... Oh, but it is, Erise. Look how blue the sky looks from here. Oh, Erise. This is better than watching the stars at night. Come, Lepkuhen, stay close to me. I wouldn't want you to get lost. Tender flesh of earthly desire. Make offering. I suppose this will be enough. I've never seen so many together. Huh? Why all these fireflies, Adisa? Fireflies? <laughs> this truly is a wonderful place. The sweetest nectar to be drunk in earnest. Suppose this will be enough. A fountain? The water's so clear. I wonder if we could drink from here. Uh, it's best if we don't. Oh, I'm sure it'll, I'm sure it'll be all right. A fountain. Is she seeing something I'm not? The good company, the object of one's affection. Make offering. I suppose this will be enough. <laughs> all right, now what's gonna happen? Erisa? Huh? Where are we? Why are we in the woods, Erisa? There's something I want to show you. No, Erisa. I'm not feeling well. Come then. Let's keep going. No, this is wrong. Please. I knew you were hiding something from me, but this is... 
This is too much, Arisa. You don't understand, Leb. No, I think I finally do understand, actually. Wait, Leb Kuhin. What did you bring me here for, Arisa? The least you can do is tell me the truth once and for all. I... Tell me, Arisa. I can't. I can't tell you, Leb. But, but you brought me here. I trusted you, Arisa. I've always trusted you with all my heart, and yet you... I can explain, Leb Kuhin. What are those things? Erise, you're... It can't be. This isn't what you think. No, this is worse than what I think. Leb Kuhin, listen. To think you could betray me like this, Erisa. Whatever it is you're planning, I can tell. Leb Kuhin. Leb Kuhin. Father. There she is, the witch. You were right to tell me you two were going on a straw. I knew it. I knew Elisa was the witch. No, I'm nothing of the sort. I... Take her. Take her to the village now. You must do away with the witch. No, wait. Let us pray, brethren. No, wait, father. This is the only way, folks. May the blessing of the Lord, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit be with us. May the hallowed Saint Walpurga take heed of our prayers. No, stop. This isn't right. Let us pray for the salvation of the witch's soul. May our Lord have mercy and forgive her sins. I won't stand for this, Father. Out with the witch. To hell with the witch. Elisa can still redeem herself. She can still be saved. Burn the witch! Burn the witch! Father, listen. May such harm be kept out of Kieferberg forevermore. I'm begging you, Father. Please stop. May Walpurga's soul be purified within her rightful vessel. O oh Lord, have mercy upon the evils of this realm. Stop. We have to help her, not... Burn the witch! Burn the witch! Is this as far as I go? Burn the witch! Burn the witch! To think this is all I'll ever amount to. Stop! Burn the witch! Burn the witch! I couldn't even reach him. God damn.
There we go. All right. Watch Elisa's final punishment. Ending nine. Auto da fe. Is this the same ending for Freya as well? Nah, I'll, I'll watch it anyway. Just to see the difference. Alright. Load. Alright. All right, now let's put the actual, the actual good company. Keep close to me, alright? It's best we don't wander about. We could get lost. Since when have you known about this place, Elisa? Since uh, Monday, I suppose. It's so beautiful. I've never seen so many butterflies in one place. I don't know if I'd call it beautiful, but... Oh, but it is, Elisa. Look how blue the sky looks from here. Oh, Elisa, this is better than watching the stars at night. Come, love Kuhin. Stay close to me. I wouldn't want you to get lost. Alright, forgot to read that, but it's fine. Oops. The gates that whole hag told me about. I did it, they're open. But if I go through with this, I... My wish. I've come all this way. I have to find him. I have to do this. I'll have him grant my wish. Uh, I'll have him grant it for me, even if it kills me. Huh. 
Huh? She was taken? I've come this far. I ought to go meet him. Fit up kit. Wait. Come on. Save. No. Can you please fucking save? Alright. We're gonna go meet him. I'm I'm soft locked. I'm stuck. I can't. I can't. I I was literally stuck. The game literally prevented me from moving. Great. Oh, middle. That was easy. <laughs> Alright. Now uh, one? Okay. I think it's this one. Yes. Here it comes. What in the Lord's name is going on here? Okay. 
Grotke, what are you doing here? <laughs> we meet again, Erisa. Who? What are you? Here, I thought you'd be happy to see me. I. I don't. Let's have a word, Erisa. You've come here for a reason, haven't you? For my wish. Why don't we discuss this over the feast you've brought me? Does he remember the last ending? Much better, isn't it? You're him, aren't you? Ozzy, it is. Ozzy. At your service. This wish of mine. Can you truly... For a price, yes. I've already brought you your gifts. What else could you... Speaking of which... Wait, I brought you what you asked me. What you asked of me. You silly girls. Yeah, you silly girls keep misunderstanding. These are mere gifts, Erisa. A little cor courtesy. You're yet to pay for what you truly desire. What? What? That witch made you think otherwise, did she? How do you know that? I know everything about you, Arisa. I knew you'd like the shoes too. So you were the one who... Rather tasteless, isn't she? Trying to use me to lure you into her belly. What? The witch? You're well aware who I'm talking about, aren't you? That old hag. Wait, actually, hold on. You can't see Leb Kuhan behind the curtains this time. Because you could see, um... Rose and Marine behind the curtains. She was speaking the truth, Elise. These gifts brought you to me. Although you didn't quite need them, did you? What do you mean? <laughs> we have a unique bond, Elise. Me, you... That witch, and your grandmother. Whole, was it? What are you... Calm down, won't you? Your grandmother is no stranger to me, lassie. Begged me for a child, and here you are, back to your roots. You mean, Granny Hole also... Conceiving you in that witch's woodland was a mistake, that's what. Made her believe she had a part in it, that you're her kin even. What are you talking about? <laughs> Why, about your dear mother, Elisa? My mother? The only mother I've ever had was Granny. Let's put that past us. You're here for a reason. You did good bringing me your tender flesh and the sweetest nectar. <laughs> Even brought me some good company for supper. For supper? Mm -hmm. So, let us dine, Erisa. <laughs> oh. Oh, that voice is so good. Oh, that voice is so good. Tell me more about what it is you desire, why don't you? That's... what I want is... 
I can't hear you, lassie. Speak up. I want to be rich. That's all I've ever wanted. Silence. My apologies, Elise. They're not so easy to tame, you see. What are they, anyhow? My golden maidens, you ask? Nothing but mere servants, Elisa. But let us focus now. You want to be rich, you say? That's what your heart most desires, is it? I want an easy, luxurious life. No more of this made of all work nonsense. I want to live in a castle to live comfortably forever. To live out my dream together with... Who are you? What are you all laughing at? I have a price, Edise. Whatever you'd like. Your firstborn child. My secondborn child. Oh? How am I to know you'll have two children, Edise? How are you to know I'll have any at all? Why, don't you trust me? I've shown you my loyalty, haven't I? I've brought you your gifts, every last one. It's the least you could do. <laughs> You're certain this is what you wanted, Issa? <laughs> A luxurious life starting right this instant. <laughs> well then, let us indulge in the first course now, why don't we? Oh, there she is. Let us make a toast, it is, eh? <laughs> what did you do to her? Me? Let her go. My, I don't think you'd want that, lassie. Our contract is sealed after all. Come now. You know what we're doing here, Elisa. I told you to let her go, you... <laughs> Let's get this out of the way, why don't we? What is that? <laughs> These gifts, Edise. The testaments to your loyalty. The tender flesh, your own mortal body. The sweetest nectar, your very own blood. The good company. Now that's... The one you hold dearest to your heart, Edise. No, that can't be. No, no, you can't do this. No, Elise. Stop, this isn't what I meant to do. Nobody told me about this. They're so noisy. Can we get this over with? So noisy, so noisy. That's what I said, you lousy crow. <laughs> Let us feast, Murim, Aziel. How could you, Edise? I trusted you. I trusted you, Edise. No, this isn't what I... <gasps> Lepkuhin's calling for me. This isn't what I meant to do. Not at all. How could you, Edise? You betrayed me. You betrayed me, Edise. Lepkuhin. She's the good company. I need to... I can still save her if I... Wait. He had an agreement, Adisa. It's a pity, isn't it? That you'd like the result to see this through. <laughs> Come now, join us, why don't you?
Okay, hold on. Why is it his voice? Why is it his voice? <laughs> oh, his voice is so good. His voice is so good. Who's his voice actor? I need to know. Let us make a toast at Issa. <laughs> what did you do to her? Me? Let her go. Why? I don't think you'd want that, Lassie. Our contract is sealed after all. Come now. You know what we're doing here, Elisa. I told you to let her go, you... <laughs> Let's get this out of the way, why don't we? <laughs> These gifts, Sidisa. The testaments to your loyalty. The tender flesh. Your own mortal body. The sweetest nectar. Your very own blood. The good company. Now that's... The one you hold dearest to your heart, Sidisa. No, that can't be. No, no, you can't do this. No, Erisa. Stop, this isn't what I meant to do. Nobody told me that nobody told me about this. They're so noisy. Can we get this over with? So noisy, so noisy. That's what I said, you lousy crow. <laughs> Let us feast, Murim, Aziel. How oh, could you, Erisa? I trusted you. I trusted you, Erisa. No, this isn't what I... The Kuhan's calling for me. This isn't what I meant to do. Not at all. How could you, Edisa? 
You betrayed me. You betrayed me, Elisa. That Guhen. She's the good company. I need to... I can still save her if I... I can still stop this. That Guhen's... She's going to die. I will never forgive you, Elisa. Never. That Guhen, she's... Glaring at me. There's so much blood. I... There's nothing I... I loved you, Elisa. How... How I loved you, Elisa. Lev Kuhan, she's... I must thank you, Erisa. Not only for the feast, but for this beautiful new addition to my entourage. <laughs> we'll meet again, Erisa. I will be there on the day your second child is born. Until we meet again, <laughs> Elisa. <laughs> what if you have, if you run out of food, like on this, you die. That's what happens, probably. Miss Erie's leader, I reckon. I'm here on behalf of Count Roman D. Halage. The Count would very much like to see you, Miss Elisa. Would you please allow me to escort you to the castle? Wishes, the manifestations of, of one, the manifestation of one's innermost desire, oftentimes leading to glorious glee, others to ruinous grief, bearers of strong emotions and hopeful hearts. Youthful girls ri risk their very soul to reach my realm, carrying their lanterns deep into the woods, lighting their paths like fireflies. One after the other. Whether they, they're granted their wish or they're offered a sacrifice. All their dreams, all their souls, all of their regret. They all fall into the palm of my hand one way or another. My beloved golden maidens, how much I cher cherish them. Out of all the souls I've consumed, Elisa is the most promising, the most fragrant. Will she thrive? Or will she sink into the depths of despair? So how's this gonna go? It's after the credits, I think.
kind of unfortunate that we can't skip skip these credits. Um, but I mean, I do love the song, so. There it is. I got precisely what he promised me. Nothing more, nothing less. Fortune, wealth, a second chance at happiness. Yet. No matter how big the ballroom, how glorious the dress is, I found myself feeling out of place. None of it came close to what I sacrificed. It all felt... vapid. Worthless. Far from what I truly wanted. <laughs> the harrowing regret haunted me day and night. Unearthly visions of her. Of the look on her face. The night I lost her forever. He too visited me in the dead of night, reminding me of my own foolishness, my futility. <laughs> All I had left was my progeny, my beloved son Henry, my one and only child. I will never put you in harm's way. Never will that demon get my second-born child. There is only you, Henry. You're my only hope. My one chance at happiness. Yet, fate wouldn't have it that way. I had twins. A boy, Henry, and a daughter. My beloved daughter. He's going to take her from me. Oh! And he did take her. As for his end of the bargain. He still had Henry. Wait, I still had Henry. Yet, I lost not only the one I loved the most. But also the fight against him. And now my daughter as well. I left to take refugee refuge in a monastery for a chance at redemption in an attempt to reach Leb Kuhan through prayer. I can't ask for your forgiveness, nor am I worthy. All I ask of thou is to allow me to spend the last of my days in peace. To prepare my soul for eternal damnation. Oh lord. If I'm to burn in hell, may I, may I at least meet her once more before I... You've done enough, Elisa. I forgive you. Oh, Lebkuhen. Come, Idiza. Let us go. Your time has come. I'm sorry, Lebkuhen. Oh, my beloved Lebkuhen. Ending three. Judas, uh, Judas's kiss. Little Green Two Shoes. Uh, and now let's get the the good ending version of this.
No, you fucking idiot. This way. Fountain, the water's so clear. My, I didn't know you had it in you. What? Elise. Bringing me to such a wonderful place, Elise. Come now, there's an even better place up ahead. <laughs> it's that old hag told me about. I did it. They're open. But if I go through with this, I... I might lose her. If what's on the other side of these gates is anything like the woods, I... I can't go through with this. Elisa. What's the matter, Elisa? So, ne. We've seen enough of this place, haven't we? I thought you had something to show me. It doesn't matter anymore, Leb. Let's go home before it gets any darker out. You've been hiding something from me, Adiza. I was, but not anymore. What do you mean? I love you, Leb Kuhan. Come now, let's have supper together. You'll never tell me, will you? What you've been hiding all week. In time, Lebkuhen. For now, all I want is to spend this evening with you. Watching the stars? We can, uh, hold hands too. My, how daring. Oh, shush, come now.
Wait. Uh, hold on. There's still something. There we go. <laughs> we left Kieferberg the week after the festival. Lepkuhin's excitement to finally leave was palpable. And so was mine. Oh, please be careful out there, my love. <laughs> I will, Granny. Don't worry about me. I'll miss you two so much. <laughs> we'll miss you too, Freya. We'll come visit. Oh, please write us often, you hear? We will, Granny. Goodbye. We didn't know what to do with ourselves. All we wanted to do was travel. Always on the road, looking for the next best town to visit. We did odd jobs here and there, stopping at every inn and living with whatever we earned each day. I could tell Leb Kuhen felt more liberated than ever. While I felt I was living a dream, having finally left the person I was in Kieferberg behind. Until the day we both realized there was something missing. We had each other. We were young and free, but... It is a... Are you sure this is what you want, it is a... <sighs> Let's at least stop by and see how everyone's doing, alright? I suppose it's been a while, that's true. Kieferberg truly is where we both feel, at, feel most at home, isn't it? Everywhere feels like home when you're with me, Leb. <laughs> Yet, there's something missing, isn't there? I suppose that's what we're going to find out. However, nothing could have prepared us for what would happen. Come now, folks. Excuse me, let me through. I need to talk to Leb Kuhen. Ah, it is it. Can we heard can we have a word about the windmill renovations? Yeah. Not now, Mr. Ainrich. I'm looking for Leb Kuhen. Okay. There you are, Leb Kuhen. Were you looking for me, Adiza? Everyone's pestering me over these renovations. Folks are moving in next month, Adiza. It's only natural. Hounding me won't make them come any faster, though. More importantly, Adiza, when you come up to the bell tower with me... Huh? What for? Why for lunch, silly? Roast sandwiches, remember? Oh no, it's noon already? I promised Mr. Ghost Gustav I'd help him and the lads with... <laughs> Come now, Adisa. You're too wound up. Let's go upstairs. Lepkuhin's now Kieferberg's elder. She's our teacher. Nurse, baker. She can do anything she sets her mind to, it seems. She still spends mo most of her time in church, if it can even be called that. We've made it a point to renovate, a, to renovate it. Away with Saint Walpurga and all those old crosses. <sighs> Say, Adisa, I was chatting with Miss Wilma just now. Oh, I told her not to pester you with her nonsense. She's been wanting to ask you about her in. You see. She's afraid she won't have enough room for everybody, and... Or just have to build her a bigger inn then. Problem solved. Generous, aren't you? Oh, shush. We can afford it. As for me, I suppose I'm the mayor now. Mr. Gustav said it was time for change after Father Hans died and appointed the role to me himself, but... I never imagined I enjoyed so much. 
What's the point of having folks over if they're not making us any money? You're enjoying this, aren't you? Things are finally starting to change around here, Leb. Can you believe folks are moving from Primaldorf to Kierkeberg now? You look the prettiest when you're passionate about something. Did you know that? <laughs> My, you're as red as the beat. Ending number seven, Bells of Dawn. Okay, um... I didn't even know you could leave the house. Thought it would just stop you. We shared the same fate, lass. What are you? You will understand in time, I'm certain. If you do follow this path, that is. Are you a ghost? You have a wish, don't you? A wish? Your deepest, darest wish. If you truly want it, then you'll have to accept his blessing. Take his hand. Huh? We will be awaiting you, lass. We? What are you? Until we meet again. Oh. Alright. Ah, it is. I was waiting for you. Waiting for me? I almost forgot to give you this. Thank you. You mentioned your hands were feeling dry, right? I didn't have to, Freya. As I right before bed every night, it does wonders for the skin. I put a little lavender in there, too. Wait, you made this yourself? Of course I did, silly. That's Papa's favorite. His hands are always dry, you see. You do have a knack for this sort of thing, don't you? Ah, uh, so I'm told, I suppose. Wait, so I'm told, I suppose. Anyhow... I best, I best move along before it gets late. Say, Elise, I was wondering. I'm going to pick up some flowers in the uh, this afternoon up in the mountains. Flowers? I thought maybe you might care to join me if you'd like. All right, I'll be there, Freya. Ah, that's wonderful. Have a nice day, Elisa. I'm sure she's best girl. Besides Wilma. What's gotten into her? Oh. A DLC would make sense, I think. I'm so glad you made it in time. I was curious about the maple, I suppose. You come now. I've been keep I've been picking up some flowers. Wouldn't they wilt if you pick if you picked them now? Uh-huh, I'm still playing with the colors. Papa's lending me a hand to dress the maple. And Miss Mariel, uh, and Miss Linda, too. Might as well invite all of Kieferberg to dress it at this rate. Why don't you help too, Edisa? Me? You could spend the night on, uh, on Friday, and we could all do it together. Uh, I'm not too certain. Well, it would be so much fun to have you. Not so good with that kind of thing, Freya. Huh? Oh, I knew Daisy's would suit you best. What would you say, Adisa? You want to stay at night? I suppose I could, but... It's alright if you don't want to, silly. That's not what I... You don't fancy me much, do you, Adisa? All I want is to be good friends with you, despite everything. I do too, you know. I wasn't trying to make you feel for me or anything of the sort. For goodness sake, that's not it, Freya. Oh, I didn't mean... I didn't even say anything yet. Oh, but I truly didn't mean to. You're always overcompensating. It makes you seem disingenuous. I'm glad we're friends, Freya. I truly am. 
You keep trying to please me day in, day out. That's not what I meant to do, Edisa. I wish you'd treat me more as a friend, Freya. Rather than someone you owe an apology to. I'll be using that ointment you made me, alright? I never meant to overcompensate. Yet, you shower me with gifts every day of the week. You don't do that to anyone else. What am I supposed to think? That's because I care for you, Elisa. Huh? There's a reason why you're the only one, silly. Anyhow, it's getting quite late, isn't it? Is everything alright, Elisa? You're as good as a beat. Why, it is getting quite late. What are you laughing at? See you around town, Nerisa. For goodness sake. You must be desperate. Do I look desperate to you? Oh, all of us were, Lassie. All of you? Why, you'll know about us in time, don't you worry. I've seen so many like you come and go throughout the years. Many like me, you say? All those years ago, had I not met him in the woods, I would be an elderly woman by now, yet all I am is... Finish your story for goodness sake. Yeah, 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 shut up. There's one here. There you are. Oh, our beloved Kieferberg. Kieferberg? Are you from Kieferberg? Why, a few of us are. How lovely of a town. How desperately I long to see it once more. What's so good about Kieferberg, would you say? You won't know un until it's too late, I'm afraid. Oh, how I wish I was in your shoes. I don't think you're aware of what that means. We certainly weren't, let alone someone like you. We? Rebirth. That's what I wished for long, long ago. You want to be reborn? Somewhere safe, somewhere far, far away. I went through all of their trials, gathered all of his gifts, and... Indeed, I was reborn. My wish was granted, yet... Yet? To think I would end up like this. Wait... What was that? There she is. Ah, uh, spend some time with her. Oh, it is. Uh, they're wonderful. <laughs> they suit me rather well, don't they? Your legs are so long. It's like they were. It's like you were made for those shoes, or the shoes were made for you. Maybe. <laughs> You're exaggerating, Freya. <laughs> Nothing of the sort, Elisa. You're so elegant. Huh? I always thought you were so graceful, even when we were younger. I'm more of a farmland lass, you see. <laughs> Made to chop wood and draw water from the well. I don't put it like that, Freya. You're different, Adisa. You're so confident and poised. Or however the fuck you say, I don't know how to say that. It's... You're not one of the folks... Wait, not one of the folks would ever agree with you, Freya. You always know when to stand your ground and what to say. Which is what gets me in trouble to begin with. I 
I can't help but, but admire the way you carry yourself, Edisa. You're truly... How I wish you I were as brave as you are. Huh? I could never talk back to Miss Roma or to anyone else for that matter. You are a little too forgiving, that's true. That's why they keep praising me left and right, I suppose. What's keeping you from speaking your mind, Freya? <laughs> oh, I'm too much of a chicken for that, Elisa. You out of your mind? I think are you out of your mind is right. You've lost your wits. And it's only Monday. <laughs> Why? Wait. Wait, hold on. Why? Why is she doing that face but with her eyes closed? She's blinking backwards. <laughs> Wait. I don't think that's the... I don't think that's the right animation. Because, like... Her default face is closed eyes. But she's blinking her eyes open. <laughs> Who's to tell you what you can or cannot do? Uh... It's not as though I can simply start. Only it truly is that simple, Freya. It is a... You're so capable and gifted. Wait, same with this one, actually. She's... Why? <laughs> Why is she blinking her eyes open? <laughs> I know how much you love this town, but even you have to admit, uh, all it does is hold folks back. I know it, Ise, yet I can't seem to get to the bottom of it. Keeper Brig is my home, after all. It's not as though you can't build a home someplace else, Freya. This is where my father is, where you are. It's, it's where my memories of my mother are, too. I've thought about Primaldorf, or even going beyond that, but... Yeah, this one's correct. She's blinking normally here. I must say, I'm glad to be here in this moment, right where I am. With you and Kieferberg. Aren't you, Elisa? You do make it more bearable, I suppose. Kieferberg wouldn't be the same to me without you, if I'm honest. You're truly... Capable and gifted? I heard you the first time, Elisa. Why, you? Say, I'll be home all afternoon tomorrow. I'll be there. For goodness sake. Night time? Yes! Alright, alright. Suspicion up? I don't give a fuck. Oh, hi! Speak of the devil. <laughs> oh, lass. I think I would be surrounded by demons on my deathbed. Your deathbed? That faithful evening. I was taken to his dwelling under the pretense of glory. What do you mean? His blessing. His blissful word. You oughtn't believe any of it. Hey, nice. Appreciate it. Just another girl with a wish. Doesn't everyone have a wish or two? Not all that meet him do. I was once what you'd call the good company, despite these red shoes. The object of her affections, I suppose. What are you talking about? I was forsaken by his den, by the one I loved. Whoever you bring to keep him company, bear in mind, this will be their fate. The good company. Ooh. 
will be a golden maiden. Just shut up. Elisa, shut up! What in the... Have you met the witch? She's so very eager to meet you again, would you believe? The witch, you say? Your paths are bound to cross before long, but... I have my doubts you'll last as... You'll last long in the black wilderness. Wait... What in the Lord's name? This way... This way... And this way... I don't know why, she kind of reminds me of Lisette. Even though I'm pretty sure Lisette isn't even supposed to be born yet in this time period. Take heed, she's taking advantage of you. Who is? That creature. She goes hungry. It's you she wants. Your flesh. The witch. Don't allow her to inf interfere with your wish. How would she interfere exactly? Wait. Her interference, she says. Another fancy kerchief. We golden maidens aren't to be sneered at. You'll understand in time, I'm certain. Why would you say that? My, you can't possibly think he'll give you his blessing. I was told otherwise. Oh, such naivety. How amusing you are. I can't wait to welcome you. What an infuriating character. We want the purse. The leather purse. We want the pants, your mare the pants. There she is. I'll spend some time with her. Ah, it is it. There you are. <laughs> loitering about, or uh, uh, loitering about home, are you, Freya? Nothing of the sort, in fact. I've been... I've been rather busy. <laughs> I've been rather busy. You did say be home all afternoon. I was going to get a head start on the festival preparations, but... I couldn't bear seeing all of Kieferberg on edge like this. More than on edge, Freya. The townsfolks are rabid. All this witch nonsense is only making things worse, too. That's why we ought to bring some cheer ourselves, Larissa. I know I did this before. For these folks? They're taking you for granted, Freya. I know it is it, but I still want to. You're working yourself into the ground for nothing, Freya. I'll be about to fuck. Uh, cheer, you say? You know better than to waste your cheer on these folks, Freya. Don't say that, Elise. Look. I've been baking pies for everyone all afternoon. That's so many. I may have gotten carried away a little. A little, you say? It was a good excuse to try out my mother's recipes. Your mother's recipes? Ah, yes. She used to keep a lot of journals. For sewing and baking, for making ointments, anything you can think of. So that's how you know how to do all of that. After all, I was too young to learn from her in person. Ah, before I forget, grape pie, was it? Huh? Your favorite, silly? It was grape pie, wasn't it? Ah, uh, I suppose. Make sure you share with Rose and Marina, alright? You baked... You baked me an entire pie, Freya? 
I'm doing it for all of Kieferberg. I couldn't forget about you, could I? I remember what you said about me, showing you with gifts, but... You're truly... I'm trying to show you how I feel, Elisa. Oh goodness, you're as, you're as red as a beet. Whose fault is that, you... I didn't even say anything that bad, silly. One more word and I'll tell Molly about these pies. <laughs> it is, uh... For goodness sake. I truly did listen to what you said to me on Sunday, you say. And everything I've said and done since then, I've meant it, so... I'm well aware, Freya. Ah, Say, I'll be lending Miss Wilma a hand by the end of tomorrow at dusk. Alright, alright, I'll be there. You could be a little bit more genuine, Adisa. You could be a little less cheeky, Freya. Oh, but it's so much fun get getting you all flustered, Adisa. Why, you... Now, before I forget, before I forget, pause everything, go up here, there she is, this bitch. Feeling rather lost, are you? What would you know about it? My, there's nothing to fear, lass. He truly is quite merciful despite everything. I see. Your wish is in good hands, as so was ours. Yet, don't forget, you will be sharing our fate if you betray him. Betray him? Why should I? Why would I? Why would anyone, huh? What? Hey, Zetro, how you doing? Can I please? There you are. You're going forth with his invitation, I see. What would that matter to you? I was once in your shoes. Haughtiness and all. Oh, but it wouldn't but it won't be long now, will it? Until your eyes are forced open, then you'll see. That this mimicry of theirs isn't without reason, girl. I know when I'm being mocked, thank you very much. Alright, that's the first one. Alright, right there, on the right. There she is. How I love you, naive sheep. Following his blissful word into this moonless hellfire of ours. What are you? We all fed his gluttony, one after the other. Our sins on earth made it into a spectacle for all to see. Who is he? Your fate as one of us is sealed, you foolish girl. What in the Lord's name is she wittering on about? Ah, there she is. You've met them, you've met them. You're mocking me, aren't you? So are they, those wretched blackbirds. All of them. His despicable vassals. What are you talking about? Murim, his faithful crow. Don't trust him, regardless of how friendly he appears. As if I trust that feathered rat. Thank you for the soup. There you are. Ah, uh, how long has it been, I wonder? Tell me, how long has it been? Since when? Since you were bamboozled by one of us. Why, you? I'm not like the others. I'm not one to share my sorrows. They'll be joining us soon enough, whether you like it or not. Out of my sight, you. Look at your face, look at your face. For goodness sake. 
Everything here is infuriating. Yeah, there she is. There she is. <laughs> Enjoying yourself, are you? Oh, Edize. I'm so glad you're here. I was losing my wits. That's like a water gun and a cardboard box. Miss Woolman's been giving you a hard time, I wager. I don't want to be mean, but she can be a little pushy. Ill-bred and ungrateful, that's what she is. All of Kieferberg would agree with me, and you know it. Sit now. Let's stop, let's stop talking about Miss Wilma for a, for a moment. You put up with too much of these folks' nonsense, Freya. I don't have much of a choice, the way I see it. Yes, you do, Freya. Folks have always praised me left and right, Adisa. I can't help but feel I ought to live up to their expectations. You don't have to live up to anything, you know that? You wouldn't understand, Arisa. Huh? Daisies truly do suit you best, don't they? That's an egg in the skull. You keep avoiding the subject, Freya. Not on purpose. Very much is, Freya. You're not serious about this. Shit. Wait, if you're not serious about this. Oh my god, I didn't save, did I? I didn't save, so if I get this wrong... Should I just look up the answer, see which one it is? But there's very little documentation on this game because it just came out. Yeah, no, there ain't jack shit. Uh... Fuck. It very much... It very much is frail. You know it, I know it. I've always been ashamed of what I did, Elisa. It's alright, Freya, it's in the past. Folks kept pitying us against each other when we were children and I... Oh, Elisa, I have to confess. Oh my god, I didn't get it wrong. I would have been so mad. But you completed all? Cool. Huh? The eggs you pick up you picked for Miss Bertha that day, I broke them. I broke them on purpose. Freya I'd made a mess of her laundry that day and I was so afraid I had to Give you an earful instead, so she'd forget about me. For goodness sake. I'm so sorry, Adisa. I did so many bad things back then. Blaming you for my blunders, getting you in trouble at every chance. And play assemble with Carrot? No, I'm playing this. Telling the townsfolk you weren't capable, they'd ask me. Yeah. Telling the townsfolk you weren't capable, so they'd ask me, and... I said it's alright, Freya. I didn't understand how I felt back then either, so I... For goodness sake, I don't hold any of that against you. Then, when you said I was overcompensating, I... I understand, Freya. I know how you feel now, right? Things are different now, aren't they? We've been spending more time together, being honest with each other. I like being your friend, Freya. Let's put it all behind and... Ah! I love spending time with you too. I've always wanted to get close to you. Freya, I can't breathe. Now that we're truly friends, I... I'm truly so... 
Oh, I'm so happy. Freya. I ought to have settled all this a lot sooner. Freya, dearie, how are the reps coming along? Ah, it's Miss Wilma. How are you so strong? Before I go, Elisa, I'll be home all afternoon tomorrow. I'll... I'll be there. Freya? I'm coming, Miss Wilma. For goodness sake. I think I'd better sit down a moment. Another one, I see. Huh? Say, what is it you're meeting him for? I don't think that's any of your business. Let me tell you something then. Forsake all you think you know about yourself. What do you mean? There's no amount of determination that can save you from him. Once you're in those woods, once you go through that door, what? You'll be left with that. Yeah, you'll be left with nothing but harrowing regret. Why are you telling me all this? Apple strudel, alright. Hello. Ignorance is, eh. Ignorance is bliss. Has nobody ever told you that? Plenty of times, I suppose. To be unable to grasp how fortunate we are until it's too late. Charmingly tragic, isn't it? I don't see what's so charming about it. You'll come to face of it, too. The ruinous grief of your biggest, heaviest regret. What's yours, then? The same as yours. We all share the same pa penitence. Talking to girls like this is never a very pleasant experience, is it? Or oh, Rosalie. What is this? Is a game uh, that you can do boss fights? Like a cat? There's a lot of games where you can do boss fights. My progeny, Edisa. Who's there? Come closer, Edisa. Delve deeper into my grove. What in the Lord's name? Your fate, Edisa. Your genesis is in the tapestry. That woman, she wished for a child of her own. At his doorstep, she kneeled and she prayed, not to me, but to him. My girl became the vessel, my soil. The babe's mortal body. In the in my very womb, they celebrate their agreement. From him came what I lack, what I failed to lay my hands upon, a human soul, a human soul to be nurtured in my womb, and later given to her as her daughter. And it pretends your PC is broken when you die. And? When in truth, it's me your body belongs to, Edisa. What? In the Lord's name? There's something under that tapestry. This though, its insides have been... My womb, used for that woman's wish. I was used, 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 used. Used? What 
in the Lord's name is going on here? What are these voices trying to tell me? There you are. You're You're wearing my brooch still. Huh? What is one to do when the Lord fails them, would you say? Wait, what are you... Our union was favored by the Lord himself, and yet... My inability to bear a child drove a wedge between us. Who are you? So, I did what I could. I resorted to his blessing instead. I've brought him, my beloved, in exchange for a baby. Wait, you can't be. All I can say to you, Edisa, who's following in my steps, is that this is what my soulmate would have wanted me to do. For my sake, for our union's sake, and for yours as well. That lass, it's as if she knew me. I don't know what's going on here, but... I can't stay here any longer. I ought to... Uh, I ought to find and save Apfel. It's called... Sai. I sure can say it, but you will get mad. You know, yeah, yeah, I figured it out. Apfel, hold tight, I'll get you out of there. Let's get you out of there and go home. And now, there she is. The woodland. This grove. It's aching. Freya? Your flesh, your blood, your love. All that's rightfully mine, my progeny. This thing's not Freya. I can give you all that you desire. What? My beloved daughter. What are you? This lass, Freya. Is she the one your heart desires? What are you? They're coming. We will meet again. And I don't know why I remember that one specifically. There she is. I'll spend some time. Ah, uh, Elisa, there you are. You don't have to be so excited each time, Freya. Buttercup is green. Oh, the best one. Okay. Buttercup is the best one, basically. Yeah. There's a pink one. I thought blue, green, and red only. Yeah, honestly, neither did I. <laughs> I can't help it. Come in now. There's something I'd like to show you. I've only ever been here once before, I think. Oh, I know. It's rather childish. Oh, what is? All these curtains and whatnot. It's like a child's room, I know. You made those yourself, didn't you, Freya? That was a voice I never heard. I don't see what's wrong with them. Miss Marielle always says that best focus on garments is all. I'd say she's right somehow. I do too much embroidering, don't I? You make all your dresses, Freya. Alright, it's time I make them a little less colorful, isn't it? Freya's the... Is the one behind... The tree all days? Don't know what that is. Mr. Gustav's overalls, too. I remember he made a great deal out of those. We both know she's right, Elisa. 
You seem to think... Yeah, you seem to think so, that's for certain. She's a proper... Seamstress, Elisa. She knows what she's talking about. That it was not about. When you... Oh, the Apple mini game. She's the one d doing that. <laughs> I guess. So are you, Freya. I also just realized that I forgot to save. So I'll have to do that mini game again if I don't get this question right. Why do you think I've but I've um, uh, for fuck's sake? I need to make a coffee. Why do you think I have a bunch of grapes on my apron? Aren't grapes your favorite? Goodness sake, Freya! It's because of you. And <laughs> look, she's blinking backwards. Like she's <laughs> she blinks by opening her eyes. <laughs> I don't think that's intentional. I think they messed up the animation. I think they switched around like the closed eye frames and the and the open eye frames. I bet Granny Ho Granny Holt to uh, embroider them for me. <laughs> Just so you weren't the only last in town with a with a dainty apron. I'll laugh all you want, you. Let me show you what I've been working on then. What do you think, Elisa? I thought I'd finally put on- Oh, for fuck's sake. I should go boil the water, huh? I thought I'd finally put this silky ribbon to good use. Oh, it's rather dainty. Do you like it then? I do like it. You even added some big frills on the, on the straps. Oh, I'm so glad you like it, Elisa. That said, isn't it rather small for you, Freya? I thought you liked them longer and wider around the waist. This one's for you, silly. Summer's on its way, isn't it? You you need something more cheery. Uh, for goodness sake. There yeah, you go, making things for me again, Freya. I can't... I can stop if you'd like me to, Elisa. But this is simply how I... I don't have anything to give back to you, is all. Oh, but you do. Huh? Won't you dance with me on Saturday, Elisa? Oh, goodness. There you are, bright red again. You're shameless, Freya. Shameless? Again, <laughs> blinking backwards. I I am not over that. You do it on purpose. All these gifts and the things you say. Of course it's on purpose, silly. Let me do these things for you. This is how I express my... I, I know. Oh, shush, for goodness sake. You're so bad at this, Adisa. I'll dance with you all you want on Saturday. Alright, Adisa. I'll be looking forward to it. Good grief. Move along now, before you melt into a puddle. Why'd it turn pink? I preferred it green. Hello, motherfucker. Have you come here to pray? No. It doesn't make a difference to you at this point, does it? You see, we Golden Maidens are conflicted beings. Huh. He saved us in a way. What his blessings and the, sacrifice, and the sacrifices we made. It's enough to forfeit our right to divine salvation, isn't it? What are you trying to say? That I'd rather share eternity with him and his entourage than face my rightful punishment in the pits of hell. Interesting. I'm gonna do it early, just in case. 
I'd never be too sure. Oh, how foolish I was. Also, I just realized here they're completely out of order. Because, like, this is, like... I'm, I'm seeing it here. It's, like, the third image, but it should be, like, the first one here. Oh, how foolish I was to think he would have granted me all my heart desires. He didn't. I faltered in my resolve and my determination. If only I had taken that last step. Why didn't you? You will know in time. I suppose I will. Hold on. You too will be bathed in gold, lass. All who meet him share the same fate. Did you not grant your wish? We golden maidens belong to him, lass. Regardless of whether it is your wish he's granted or if you were gifted to him. What? To think I was once in your shoes. Gifted to him. Okay, there's one of them. Cruel, aren't you? Huh? Is your with is your wish truly worth what you're sacrificing? I don't think that's any of your business. You've been brand let's say you've been branded already, have you? Lots of all these questions. My, I'm just trying to tell you. I know I made plenty, and so did the rest of you. Well, I have no intention of ending up like the lot of you. We'll meet again then, sooner rather than later, for goodness sake. Okay. No! You fucking bitch! Six and a half hours later. Oh my god, I found it. That one was awful. That- this one is disgusting. I was told you have a brave heart. I'm told? By whom? Your grand desire for fortune and comfort runs even deeper than mine. I too longed for glory. For a chance at happiness, just like you. This ill-fitted prayer of yours. Of ours. It's a chimera of a dream. Nothing but a golden casket. So... Is this a warning of some kind? Oh, you arrogant, foolish lassie. Not quite my fault hers didn't work out, is it? God, this one sucked. Oh my god, I hate this one with passion. On top of... Of... Elisa. I think it was. <sighs> Brethren. I've gathered you all... Uh, <laughs> I've gathered you here today to address the recent goings on. You're rather late, father. We've had enough. Show some respect, Elma. No, she's right. We need answers, father. Hmm. There's a hair on my, my computer. I'm afraid we will not be getting many today, Guido. Get out of my head. Get out of my screen. If this is yet another plea for us to overlook the situation, hmm. why don't we let Father Hans take the lead? He's had it all week, and look where he got... Uh, yeah. And look where it got us, Gustav. Mm. We're to gather here this evening for a vigil, brethren. Together, we are to appeal to the Lord's mercy and benevolence, as well as... 
All that'll do is put lid on folks' troubles, father. That's right. We need to switch to pay. Who would you suggest out? Yeah, who would you suggest out to pay, Lorelai? Just gonna pop in for a minute because it's almost midnight for me, and I'll fall asleep at some points. Have a really great stream. All right. Thanks for dropping by. Don't worry. Have a um, go to sleep if you need sleep. Yeah, it's gonna be midnight for an hour for me too. Um, but I'm gonna be ruining my sleep schedule as I always do. Who would you suggest not to pay, Lorelai? Where's this witch you folks speak of? Gustav's right. We don't know where to turn. Prayer will show us the path we ought to follow, brethren. Why, I've prayed all day, every day, and nothing's changed, father. I fear for my poor Jacob, father. Whoever is out there, they're taking our children, compromising our livelihoods. It's a decision folks want, Hans. We ought to search every last in town for the witch's mark. We ought to do no such thing, you old geezer. That's no way to address your elders, Elisa. Perhaps if my elders hadn't completely lost their wits. Rest assured, Elisa, no less than Kieferberg will be searched, young or old. You fool still resist what must be done. Old Yurchin is right, we must see this through. Are you going to do it then, Mr. Ludwig? If there's anyone who ought to do it, it's Lev Kuhan. Me, Miss Brunhilde? Of course, lass. You're a, woman of, you're a woman of God. Woman of God or not, Leb Kuhan is to be searched as well. None of you are touching her. Still, Edisa, we ought to search someone. It may be for the best, Edisa. Are you searching for you too, then? And Miss Lisbeth? No exceptions, lass. Truth is, we don't know anything about your cousin, Adisa. Why don't we start with her? That's right. This all started the day she got here. N no, I haven't done anything. Nobody's laying a finger on her. I saw her. I saw the witch. I saw Freya in the woods. My beloved daughter. Elisa saw her too. She talked to the witch. There it is, folks. There, there are the witches. Oh, Apfel. Get a hold of yourself, old lad. So it was true, Elisa. You and Freya are the ones who've been making our lives hell. No. I'll never do such a thing. Confess, a lot of you. Confess your sins, you wretched witches. Did you or did you not meet Frey in the woods, Arisa? Of course I didn't. I was all by my, I was all by myself right until I found him. Why? The lad says he saw you too, Arisa. I didn't meet anyone in the woods. I swear. Oh my goodness! Look. It's the witch. The witch is here. Oh, we're all going to die. You must keep calm, folks. Keep calm. She was there. I saw her. She had yellow eyes. What do you have to say for yourself, lass? Yellow eyes? I, I don't understand. Oh, I wouldn't, th I wouldn't think Freya would... We know better than that, Brunhilde. If Apel says he saw her, who are we to say otherwise? The lad's confused, Guido. You oughtn't believe everything you hear. Papa, I, I swear I didn't... This is Freya we're talking about, you fuck. Oh, I could never believe such a thing. Adisa has always been a bad influence on the poor lass, after all. 
What were you doing in the woods, Freya? She was nowhere near the woodland, Bernard. Oh, tell them, Elisa. I didn't leave Kieferberg all day. Well, no, Freya wouldn't. I met Freya just earlier. I don't think that's... Wait, just earlier? Like... What does that prove? Uh... Just earlier? Like... That fella is clearly confused, Mr. Bernard. Oh, I'm not so certain that's all there is to it, Elisa. There is no more to it, Miss Wilma. The lad wouldn't lie about such a thing. Would you, lad? I I saw her, I did. Athel's just tired and afraid, that's all. Are you seriously that afraid? No, Athel's just tired and afraid. Can't you see what's happening here, you fuckers? Athel knows what he saw, Lassie. There's no reason to doubt the lad. The witch must be one of you, if not both. Papa, I swear I didn't. Listen to yourselves. Accusing me is one thing, but I won't hear a word about Freya. So you are the witch, you wretch. I've heard enough. I won't stand for this. Search them both. You must search them right now. Find the witch's mark. I'll take no more of this nonsense. This is enough. Can't you see what you're doing to Kieferberg? Can't you see this witch nonsense that's turning us against, you, against each other? The witch is clearly right here in Kieferberg, lass. Nobody in Kieferberg could ever do such a thing, old Yojan. We're a family, all of Kieferberg, no exceptions. It's, it has a different feel coming from her since she's the one being accused, but... Although we all understand your feelings, Freya. You clearly don't, father. Nobody does. Abfeld believes he's seen the witch. Folks have been on edge all day. Well, if it's the consequence of how we've been facing this crisis. With fear, hostility, and hesitation. That's all very nice, Freya, but we need to do something. Let's do the vigil, then. Work on the preparations for the festival together. Like the family we are. The family we've always been. Freya. Would you folks truly burn me at the stake? Or Elise, Leb Kuhan, even Rose and Marina? I expect more from my family, that's all I wanted to say. You said more than enough, Freya. All of Kieferberg is to meet here tonight for prayer. As we ought to have done from the start. We have a long now, folks. We are to focus on what we ought to do. Protect our home at all costs. So it probably would have been like better coming from Lev Kuhen. Uh but I do want to see uh what shows when I go up here. Mm -hmm. Oh no it's just that, alright. There she is. I'll spend some time with her. Because she is best girl. I thought you wouldn't come about after all that. I'm sorry, I... It all got out of hand and I... It wasn't your fault, Adisa. Still, Freya, had it not been for you, I don't think... More importantly, Adisa... 
Huh? That's enough brooding over nonsense, wouldn't you say? Won't you lend me... <laughs> Won't you lend me a hand with these grapes? I suppose. I've been thinking about yesterday, you see. About how much I enjoy making things, and... And? I could try making a living out of it, couldn't I? Uh... The audio is... Is... Fucked. Um... I'll just wait for it. I'll just wait for the audio to come back. Hold on. How that is... How does it even sound on stream? Hold up. Wow, it sounds exactly how... How I'm hearing it. Well, that's great. Oh, and the game is frozen now. At least I saved. There we go. See, it's back. Maybe someplace else, like Primaldor. What, what, what did even? What did she even say? I'm thinking about yesterday. You see, uh, about how much I enjoy making things, and and I could try making a living out of it, couldn't I? Maybe someplace else, like Primaldor. If there's anyone who could do it for you, it'd be you. Then, how about a jeweler? A jeweler? Wouldn't these grapes make the most charming earrings? It would be so much fun. I'd make earrings and necklaces all day. Oh, and brooches just like yours too. You've thought about going to Primaldorf then. Wait, you've thought about going to, to Primaldorf then. Uh, this is just a silly idea of mine, Adisa. There's still so much to think about before I truly commit. Uh, you'll waste all of your potential, Freya. Or hopeless, aren't you? Nobody else can commit for you, Freya. Everything's three times as difficult for us here. It truly is. I'm sorry, Adisa. I'm... I feel rather shaken by what happened earlier. I. It's alright, Freya. I'm heading back now. I'll see you about town. Oh. I don't think that was. Alright. I don't think that was the correct. Uh, the correct. thing. Fuck. Um. It's a good thing I saved. I feel like every time I've picked the option, you're hopeless, it just, it just always results in like, in like the other person like hating me. <laughs> God, is my Riz that bad? Like fucking hell. Come time of her. You'll waste all of your potential, Freya. If you keep thinking like that anyhow, you need to be more confident. Wait, I just realized the game even- oh yeah, yeah. I understand it's not easy for you, but... No, I know. It truly is in my hands, Adisa. I might have when I said you were gifted, Freya. You could be a jeweler, a jeweler, or a seamstress, or anything you want to be. I'm glad to see you've given it, you've given it some proper thought. I truly am. You've been encouraging me so much. I suppose I 
Look, Freya, up there. Let me get those grapes for you. They're so big. Oh, please be careful. That barrel's too old for that. It is it. Are you alright, Ediza? You could have gotten hurt for goodness sake. You haven't been eating enough, have you? Why, well, I certainly have. Put me down. You're light. You're light as a feather, Elisa. Could carry you about time like this all day. Put me down. For goodness sake. You might even be stronger than Mr. Gustav. Say it, Elisa. If I do leave Kieferberg for Primeldorf and... Try my luck as a seamstress or whatever else. You'll have my support, Freya. Come here. Not this again. My back still hurts, Freya. Wait. Oh god, stop that. There, there she is, okay. One more to join the entourage, I see. Huh? Oh, it's marvelous. You'll surely agree. The banquet, the spectacles, the prestige. What are you talking about? You'll see when you get there. Oh, he's given me all I could ever want. Which was? Why, luxury, wealth, opulence. Oh, I can't wait to have you and your inamorata with us. My what? Inamorata is, is it fucking Italian. The fuck up. There she is. The last one. You've come here to stay, I see. Says who? A place of solace. That's what our beloved Aziel is providing for us here. All I've heard in here was weeping, though. We're all doomed. All of us. We've lost everything. All we have left are these depths. What's so great about this place, would you say? The silence. He never visits here. I can't say I understand. That's all 25 of them. Uh... Now, what the fuck was the orc? Working on what? Yes, I know. What in the... You're rather brave, lass. You. Do you yearn for wealth and fortune that deeply? I clearly do, sir, but now let her go. No, I don't think I will. In the Lord's name? Wait, this one has a more jester look. Why? You know, there's something you have yet to come to terms with. Something you've been avoiding. What are you talking about? The good company, Les. You've sacrificed your mortal body for the tender flesh. You know it's your blood needed for the sweetest nectar, yet, it's the good company you refuse to surrender. What are you talking about? Show me the depths of your heart. What? I wish to see how dearly you care for your beloved. I am surprised I dodged that. Yes, and that one, there we go. I thought it was weird that I managed to dodge it. Ooh. 
What the fuck? Power done. Power done. Give me a minute. You want to know how deeply I care for Freya? I was too prideful to come to terms with it, but I now have him. I'm envious of her. I've always been envious and resentful no, uh, for no good reason. No, not this time. And my controls are reversed. Ah. I'm somehow a I can't I can't I can't I don't I can't control her Please can you reverse the screen thank you very much No Go fuck yourself She's truly so loving and genuine. I'm the one who's bitter and lonely. I always resented her for nothing. We both have similar ambitions, but... Her dreams are the real deal. She's better than me. Her dreams are the real deal. Freya dreams of becoming someone while I'm so caught up with being petty. Can you stop using this attack? And oh, and there goes the screen. Okay, that was a free dodge. one. She's always so dedicated, so mindful of everyone's needs. I don't think I can ever be like her, but she's been bringing out the best in me. If I'm with Freya, I can truly leave myself behind, leave the sound behind, leave myself behind, and grow out of this bitterness that's taken hold of me. No way I just first tried that blind. God damn. It's shaking. What's this? Where are all those fireflies going? Don't tell me they're going to Granny's bedroom. Yep. Yeah, they are. What in the Lord's name? Don't misunderstand, Lassie. You can't take it back. I have no regrets, demon. Take her and do with her what you will as long as you keep your promise just the same as i've kept mine rather cold aren't we i've made my choice that's all very well Les. i'll be expecting you at my benkei Don't tell me those are... No... No way they are. 
No, sure. No, 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 no. You know what? No, they're not. They're not. I don't. I'm. 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 They. They. They can't be. Wait. You can't do this to me. What did you? Wait. What? Who said that? I'll pen. Oh, never mind. Yeah. No, they aren't. <laughs> the okay. I was thinking something else entirely. Wait, you can't do this to me. What did you do, Valerie? I've... You've had it coming since long... Since long ago. Alpen Rose. Flaunting your wealth in our faces day in and day out. What are you talking about? Really, Valerie? I don't want to do this anymore. He's sworn it, Sani. We got him the gifts. He's sworn he'll get us both out of here. No, I can't. Wait, Sani. What is this about, Valerie? This is all your fault, Al Alpen Rose. All of it. You. You there, help me. Huh? Me? It's too late for you, Alpen Rose. No, Valerie, don't. I didn't know they could die. What in the... What did you... You'll become one of us too, Lassie. Huh? Kept close to him and his vassals, right to answer their very whim. Trinkets, show pieces, kept for his amusement. Whether it's your wish he's granting or someone else's, this is the price to pay for uttering his name. The price was paid for his blessing. Get away. Stop. What was that? A dream? Wait a minute. Uncover the truth of the Golden Maidens. If I... Fuck. I thought it would be different. Damn it. What in the Lord's name? It's been a long time since I've gone into Granny Hole's room. Thought there's anything to see in there anyhow. This thing's still not working, is it? I ought to have a word with myself. Well, helm sometime soon, I suppose. So much for saying about progress protection. I had to burn you out a long time ago. Making the most of today, aren't you? It is a. You've been dancing around the maple all day, Freya. Aren't you tired? More importantly, it is it. Will you dance with me? Uh, I was hoping we could. Oh, but you have to dance with Rose and Madden, with Rose and Marine at least. We have to make the most of the festival while she's here, it is it. Uh, you're truly. Is everything alright, Edisa? You haven't changed one bit, Freya. Oh god. Uh, yeah, that's um... Can you not? Thank you. Even after yesterday, you're still... Rather glad to be here in Kieferberg. That's it, isn't it? I'm sorry, I shouldn't be talking about this today. All that happened yesterday made me realize Kieferberg won't be around forever, Lisa. Or that I won't be in Kieferberg forever, rather. Speaking of which, Freya... Oh, let's please 
stop talking about such things. It's the day of the festival. I want to make the most of it with you. That's not it, Freya. Come now, let's dance, Aditha. When you uh, come with me up to the viewpoint, Freya. The viewpoint? There's something I'd like to tell you is all. Oh, but we haven't danced together yet. We can always dance later, can't we? We have to move along then before it gets too late. Ikuza. I must dance with you after all, or you'll, or you'll lose your mind. It is. Uh... Alright. I've had it. I would have carried you all the. Uh, I, I would have carried you had I known you were tired, Derisa. Haven't you had enough of that this week? Do you truly want me to answer that? For goodness' sake! It's still a wonderful festival, isn't it, Derisa? Even if it's a little quieter this year. It used to be a great deal... Uh, it used to be a great deal livelier, that's for certain. Oh, I would've... I wonder what Primaldorf's festival are like. I'm certain they're much bigger and more colorful than ours. You should go and see for yourself, Freya. Do you mean we, Erise? I suppose. You see, Erise... You've truly encouraged me a great deal this past week. I didn't mean all I said, Freya. Even the mistakes, I guess. You helped me understand my own feelings better, Elisa. That as much as I love Kieferberg, I want more for myself. Me too, Freya. I feel the same about Kieferberg. But also, I have something. Oh, you've always made it clear you want to you want to leave, Seely. You're always so certain about what you want, Adisa. I feel like I can do anything when I'm with you. Don't be silly, Freya. You can do anything without me. I do mean it, Adisa. I can't picture myself without you. If you truly believe I can become a seamstress in Primaldorf, then I do too. I could become a princess in that castle, even, as long as I'm with you. For goodness sake, you're too embarrassing. I know I could do all these things without you, Arisa. Yet, you give it so much more meaning. I truly... Going too fast, Freya? Stop. You're going too fast. Before you carry on, there's something I... All that jealousy I felt for you turned into something else, and it took me this long to realize that I... What do you mean, turned into something else, Freya? Nice. I truly do. This past week has been a dream come true. You... I know this is all very sudden, but... When you come to Primaldorf with me, Adisa? To Primaldorf, you say? Even beyond that, I want to see how far we can go together. You're truly so... I've talked to Papa about it already, too. What? He knows? That we've been flirting about town? Of course. Oh, I'm as good as dead. Don't be silly. He's part of it too. He said I ought to follow my heart while I can. What a good dad. For goodness sake. You can give me an answer when you're ready, Arisa. Before I say anything else, Freya, when you come with me, there's something I'd like to show you. Oh. Okay, guess I don't even need to say it. Come then, it's not far. Okay. 
Poking of love. Nice. Okay. Um, alright. Now, uh, there's three endings we gotta go. Freya. <laughs> this is it. There's no going back. I've got everything. It's only a matter of... Is everything alright, Adiza? <laughs> ah, yes. Let's move along now. Alright. Save progress? Yes. Uh, here. It's imperative that I save there. I forgot to put the sweetest nectar in... Keep close to me, alright? It's best we don't wander about. We could get lost. Oh, it is. Uh, I never knew there was such a wonderful place. I don't know if I'd call it wonderful, Freya. Why, but isn't it? Look at all these butterflies and all these flowers. The sky is so blue here, too. How did you find out about this place? Come Freya, stay close to me. I wouldn't want you to get lost. Uh... Alright. So, Sphere so Snack there. This. And... This I'm gonna fill it with. Um... I'm sure you'll appreciate this silky purse. You'll love it. I'm certain. Tender flesh of earthly desire. Make an offering. Ah, so many fireflies. Huh? They're so bright and golden. Oh, you should have told me about this place sooner, Elisa. I'm not sure what she's talking about, but... Okay. I'm gonna ignore the golden maze for now, but in the next uh, save file, because I'm gonna have to reset. In the next file, I'm gonna talk to all of them. Are we almost done with the game? Yes, we are almost done. I just need to get three endings. The sweetest nectar to be drunk in earnest. Make an offering. I suppose this will be enough. I just need to get the... The good ending, the bad ending with Freya, and also the incomplete ending. Oh, look at this fountain. I wonder who put this here. What are you talking about, Freya? My, quit teasing me, Elisa. She hasn't been making much sense, has she? Eh, hey, fuck it, I don't need that. The good company, alright, make an offering. And that's the wrong offering. And now... Uh, this should be one of the endings. It is a... Huh? Where are we? 
Weren't we out on the fields just a moment ago? Oh, we're in the... This is... Where are we, Elisa? The woods, Freya. That's what I wanted to show you. No, I... That place truly was beautiful, but this isn't... I feel strange, Elisa. I don't like this. It's alright, Freya. We can just keep going, right? I don't think I want to go any deeper, Elisa. We could get lost, or even worse, we could... You trust me, don't you, Freya? I do, but I don't want to be here, Elisa. Do you eat spicy food? Um, I'm actually a bit of a pussy when it comes to spicy food. Um, I can eat like spicy barbecue wings, but like those are like are like very mildly spicy, and even those like they they fuck me up pretty badly if I eat like a lot of them. Um. So yeah, usually I just kind of avoid spicy food. Let's go back. Elisa? If we go a little further, there's an even more beautiful place, Freya. Why did you bring me here, Elisa? I keep telling you, there's a place I... No, I don't believe you. Listen, Freya. No, Elisa, this makes no sense. I don't remember getting here, or how we even... You've got the wrong idea, Freya. Edisa, what are those? This isn't what you think, Freya. No, I don't believe it. Freya? To think you were... That you were the... Freya! Freya! Papa! There she is, the witch. You did well in telling me you were going on a show with Elisa. I knew it. I knew Elisa was the witch. No, I'm nothing of the sort. I... Take her. Take her to the village now. We must do away with the witch. No, wait. I got the festival music was playing. <laughs> Let us pray, brethren. No! Wait, father! Stay put, Freya. There's no changing things now. May the blessing of the Lord, the Father and the Son, and the Holy Spirit be with us. May the hallowed Saint Walpurga take heed of our prayers. No, stop! We can't do this. Let us pray for the salvation of the witch's soul. May our Lord have mercy and forgive her sins. Papa, tell them to stop. Out with the witch. To hell with the witch. She can still redeem herself. We don't have to do this. Burn the witch! Burn the witch! No, listen! May such harm be kept out of Kieferberg forevermore. Make them stop. May Walpurga's soul be purified within her rifle vessel. Oh Lord, have mercy upon the evils of this realm. Stop! Burn the witch, burn the witch. Is this as far as I go? Burn the witch, burn the witch. To think this is all I'll ever amount to. Stop. Burn the witch, burn the witch. I couldn't even reach him. Da kinina heia cru sohineria turano. 
All right, that's one ending. And I can't skip this credits, so we're just gonna have to listen to the song. Where's my goddamn phone? Uh, what? Um, yeah, that happened. She dead? Oh, uh, I mean, we should have a, a death counter for Elisa. She died like 30 million times. Most of the times because I let her die, but still. She's not the witch? Yeah, she isn't. <laughs> Actually, technically she is the daughter of the witch, because uh, she was born from the witch's womb, so technically she is a witch, technically. I should have made coffee while the credits were rolling. I'm a fucking moron. Why didn't I do that? Am I retarded? <sighs> Alright, fuck it. I'll just stay i I'll just stay tired. No? What? Okay, these credits I can skip, if the game lets me. Game. That's your cue, thank you. Okay. This ending I technically already got, but I got it in Lebkuhen's, um... Lebkuhen's POV. And I wanted to see Freya's. Alright. Alright. I just Ow. Ow. Oh my god. I just scratched myself, but like in like literally, like I actually like I think I actually cut my own skin. Ow. Like I had an itch, but I, I scratched it too hard. Ow. <laughs> okay, now let's put the uh let's put the actual stuff where it belongs. Um so yes, Nectar. Oh fuck, it hurts so much. And token of love. All right. How the fuck did I cut myself? I have no nails. I bite my own nails. You should see what my hands look like. Like it's actually comical that I managed to to cut myself. Ah, uh, I just have fucking kill Lua's hands or some shit. 
Ah, oh, this hurts. Alright, now let's talk to them. Oh, how wonderful. How I miss being in your shoes, lass. Putting all your eggs in one basket, are you? Not that I can blame you. Playing with fire is rather addictive, isn't it? Fingers crossed you won't get burned. Such lovely company you're bringing him, lass. A bit of a waste, isn't it? Oh, that poor, poor witch. One truly can't win against him, huh? My, aren't you generous. I'll be looking forward to having that friend of yours join us for dessert. You're almost there, lass. Oh, how exciting. Would you say it's worth it, lass? Not that you would know before meeting him either way. Aren't you daring? Going against her wishes like that. Yes, a fountain. It's very, very clearly a fountain. Look at that. That's the most fountainy fountain I've ever seen. Alright. The good company. Suppose this will be enough. Token of love. This is so awfully romantic of you. Ah, uh, I suppose. Come now, there's an even better place up ahead. I also want to do this because Freya is best girl, but we must get all the endings. The gates that old that old hag told me about. I did it, they're open. But if I go through this, I. My wish. I've come all this way. I have to find him. I have to do this. I'll have him grant it for me if it kills me. She was taken? I've come this far. I have to go meet him. <laughs> can I... Can I save? Thank you. It's, imp it's important that I do not save over this. <laughs> I 
out. I can't see what's ahead of me. Also, I'm almost dead. Um... That solved my issue. Alright. Alright. What hit me? What? Uh, okay, I'm almost dead again. Uh, eat another one of these. Alright. I see it. This one again. Okay. I broke it. Alright. Lord's name is going on here. Okay. Um, can I please save? Thank you. Alright. skip this part but honestly I'm not even mad that I can't skip it what are you doing here <laughs> who you meet again it is who what are you I thought you'd be happy to see me. I... I don't... Let's have a word, Eriisa. You've come here for a reason, haven't you? For my wish. Why don't we discuss this over the feast you brought me? Much better, isn't it? You're... him, aren't you? Ozzy, Erisa. Ozzy. At your service. This wish of mine... Can you truly... For a price, yes. I've already brought you your gifts. What else could you... Speaking of which... Wait, I've brought you what you asked of me. You silly girls keep misunderstanding. These are mere gifts, Erisa. A little courtesy. You're yet to pay what you, for what you truly desire. Are you gonna go 
cup of, co a cup of coffee? Not yet. Not yet. Uh, I'm gonna wait for the credits to roll. What? That witch made you think otherwise, did she? How do you know that? I know everything about you, Iriza. I knew you'd like the shoes too. So you were the one who... Rather tasteless, isn't she? Trying to use me to lure you into her belly. What? The witch? You're well aware who I'm talking about, aren't you? The old hag. She was speaking the truth, Arisa. These gifts you brought me. Although you didn't quite need them, did you? What do you mean? <laughs> we have quite a unique bond, Arisa. Me, you, that witch, and your grandmother. Whole, was it? What are you... Calm down, won't you? Your grandmother is no stranger to me, lassie. Bagged me for a child, and here you are, back to your roots. You mean, Granny Hole also... Conceiving you in that witch's woodland was a mistake, that's what. Made her believe she had a part in it. That you're her kin, even. What are you talking about? <laughs> Why, about your dear mother, Elisa? My mother? The only mother I've ever had was Granny. <laughs> Let's put that past us. You're here for a reason. You did good bringing me your tender flesh and the sweetest nectar. <laughs> Even brought me some good company for supper. For supper? Mm -hmm. Let us dine, it is it. Oh. oh, his voice is so good. Oh, his voice is so good! Tell me more about what is it you desire, why don't you? That's... What I want is... I can't hear you, lassie. Speak up. I want to be rich. That's all I ever wanted. Silence! My apologies, Elisa. You're not... They're not so easy to tame, you see. Also, behind the curtain we can see uh, Freya. What are they, anyhow? My golden maidens, you ask? Nothing but mere servants, Edisa. But let us focus now. You want to be rich, you say? That's what your heart most desires, is it? I want an easy, luxurious life. No more of this made of all work nonsense. I want to live in a castle, to live com comfortably forever. See Freya? Yeah, she's behind the curtains. <laughs> to live out my dream together with... What are you all laughing at? I have a price, Edisa. Whatever you'd like. Your firstborn child. My secondborn child. Oh? How am I to know you have two children, Edisa? How are you to know I have any at all? Why? Don't you trust me? I've shown you my loyalty, haven't I? I've brought you your gifts. Every last one. It's the least you could do. <laughs> You're certain this is what you wanted, Isa. A luxurious life, starting right this instant. <laughs> well then, let us indulge in the first course now, why don't we? Let us make a toast, Elisa. <laughs> what did you do to her? Yeah. Me? Let her go. <laughs> My, I don't think you'd want that, lassie. Our contract is sealed after all. <sighs> Come now. You know what we're doing here, Elisa. I told you to let her go, you... <laughs> Let's get this out of the way, why don't we? <laughs> These gifts, Elisa. 
the testaments to your loyalty, the tender flesh, your own mortal body, the sweetest nectar, your very own blood, the good company, now that's the one you hold dearest to your heart, Eriise. No, that can't be. No. No, you can't do this. Get away from me. No. Stop. This isn't what I meant to do. Nobody told me about this. They're so noisy. Can we get this over with? So noisy, so noisy. That's what I said, you lousy crow. Let us feast, Murim, Aziel. No, stop. I don't want to die. It is it. I want my papa. No, this isn't what I... Eriza, Eriza, please. Freya, the good company. This isn't what I meant to do, not at all. Please, please have mercy. I want my papa. Papa, please. Mr. Gustav, he doesn't know. I can still, I can still save her. I can still stop this. I can still... Papa, Papa, save me. Freya, she's crying. There's so much blood. So much blood? Alright, let's see. <laughs> we had an agreement, Teresa. It's a pity, isn't it? That you'd like the result to see this through. <laughs> Come now, join us, why don't you? So, uh, where's the blood? I was promised that there would be so much blood. Please, I beg of you. Alright. Alright, let me actually get the ending this time. I was promised blood, and there ain't no blood. I was lied to. Uh, what's going on now? Um, I died and I have to restart that. <laughs> I have to restart this. I was promised blood and there wasn't any, so... <laughs> I blame the game for that. I know I love Ozzy's voice, but god damn, I wish I could skip. Honestly, like, this guy makes me wish that the game had, like, full voice acting. Just because I want to hear his voice. His voice is so goddamn good. He has that Hitsugaya kind of voice, you know? Voice. 
うねあっそう<laughs> okay, we're back to where we were. No, this isn't what I... Adisa, Adisa, please. Prayers, the good company. This isn't what I meant to do, not at all. Please, please have mercy. I want my papa, papa, please. Mr. Gustav, he doesn't know. I can still, I can still save her. I can still stop this. I can still... Papa, papa save me. Freya, she's crying. There's so much blood. If I don't stop this, Freya will... No, no. I don't want to die, I don't want to die. If I don't stop him, he will... I must thank you, Eriza. Not only for the feast, but for this beautiful new addition to my entourage. <laughs> we'll meet again, Eriza. I will be there on the day your second child is born. What? Freya? And Eriza? Well, no, Eriza is alive. <laughs> Elisa died in, a, in like an alternative universe. Until we meet again, Elisa. Miss Elise Liedel, I reckon. I'm here on behalf of Count Roman D. Healage. The Count would very much like to see you, Miss Elise. Would you please allow me to escort you to the castle? Wishes, the manifestation of one's innermost desire. Oftentimes leading to glorious glee, others to ruinous grief. Bears of strong emotions and hopeful hearts. Youthful girls risk their very soul to reach my realm. 
carrying their lanterns deep into the woods, lighting their paths like fireflies one after the other. Whether they're granted their wishes or they're off offered a sacrifice, all their dreams, all their souls, all of their regret. They all fall into the palm of my hand, one way or another. My beloved golden maidens, how much I cherish them. Out of all the souls I've consumed, Elise's is the most promising, the most fragrant. Will she thrive, or will she sink into the depths of despair? Alright. Unskippable credits. Okay. So... I'm gonna go and make myself a cup of tea, but there is an after credit scene, so we'll... So I'll probably be back in time to read that. But... Well, not much I can do without the kettle boiling, so yeah, I have to wait for the kettle to boil. Wait, actually, no, I, I'm an idiot. I need to get the actual coffee ready. Oh, shit, these guys are almost finished. Hold up. This wasn't like this days from during the huh? What? I got precisely what he promised me. Nothing more, nothing less. Fortune, wealth, a second chance at happiness. Yet. No matter how big the ballroom, how glorious the dresses, I found myself feeling out of place. 
None of it came close to what I sacrificed. It all felt... vapid, worthless. Far from what I truly wanted. <laughs> the harrowing regret haunted me day and night. Unearthly visions of her, of the look on her face the night I lost her forever. He too visited me in the dead of night, reminding me of my own foolishness, my futility. All I had left was my progeny, my beloved son Henry, my one and only child. I'll never put you in harm's way. Never will that demon get my second-born child. There is only you, Henry. You're my only hope, my one chance at happiness. Yet, they wouldn't have it that way. <laughs> I can't. I had twins. A boy, Henry, and a daughter. My beloved daughter. He's going to take her from me. And he did take her as per his end of the bargain so basically if you if you go for Lev Kuhens or Freya's route she does not name drop her daughter <laughs> she does not say her daughter's name I still had Henry yet I'd lost not only the one I loved most but also the fight against him and now my daughter as well I found myself going back to Kieferberg. I had to go there once more, to the viewpoint. That special place where I'd shared so many memories with her. What I found was a grave for the both of us. To my beloved daughter Freya. And to my beloved Edise, whom I loved as my own flesh and blood. May we all find closure. May they both be in a better place, Mr. Gustav. Oh, what have I done? If only I hadn't been so blind. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry, Freya. I loved you. I truly did, and I still do. I still do, Freya. Treacherous Rose. Ending 2. This is the saddest ending of, all, of the three. <laughs> uh, but... We won't be finishing on a... On a sad ending. Because there is still one more ending, the happy one. That I save for last because Freya is best girl. I also forgot to... Wait. Oh, there's actually a, a thing for the woodland. So what happens if I go in it deeper? How am I only just now realizing this on the literal last ending of the game? My computer is having... It's, uh, my computer has just had enough. My computer is just like, I, he, I can't do this anymore. Oh. Oh. So this is what happened when you open the map in... In the... In the thingy. Okay. I'm 
I don't need items. I don't know why I'm picking them up. Let's end, let's end it on a happy note. The gates that old hag told me about. I did it, they're open. But if I go through it this I I might lose her. If what's on the other side of those gates is anything like the woods, I I can't go through with this. Is everything all right, Eriza? Let's go home, Freya. Oh, already? I thought there was something you wanted to show me. No, it's all right. It's getting late too, and we still have to dance around the maple. <laughs> That's true. We wouldn't want folks to start cleaning up before we got the chance. Hmm? I, uh, you see... <laughs> Come now, Eddie, say, I said it's just, I said it's just fine, you can do it too. Oh, for goodness sake, you're not making it any easier. I love you, Freya. It shows. Why you? Let's go then, back to Kieferberg. Wherever you want to go, Freya. And unskippable credits.
All right. Cool. That's the last time we'll see those credits, so... Cool. There we go. <laughs> it didn't take us long to leave town after the festival. Everyone saw us off with tears in their eyes, as we'd be leaving for good. See you, Arisa. See you, Freya. Don't forget to come visit. Papa. Please don't cry, Papa. I'll come visit as often as I can. Will you write too? <laughs> oh, of course, Papa. You'll make me cry if you keep that up. Mr. Gustav still writes us every week without fail. Once we arrived in Primaldorf, we found ourselves a cramped townhouse. It was riddled with cobwebs, and we didn't have much of anything at first. We both worked as maids. Yeah, we both worked as maids of all, of all work, just like we've done in Kieferberg. I got a tip today, Elise. Someone needed help having some curtains. Put it in the jar, Freya. Oh, we'll have enough for the sign next week, if we keep going like this. Never mind the sign. We need to get you a proper shop first. It wasn't long until we found a small ground floor shop for rent. Should we move that... Should we move that one more to the right, Freya? Oh, I was thinking we could, we could hang some on the wall over there, too. Are you done arranging all of your threads and ribbons? Not yet. I have to dust the shelves first. We have to hurry, Freya. We open in an hour. Oh, I know, Erise. I'm so nervous. Are you ready, Freya? I go open the doors now, alright? Ah, Erise, wait. Will you let me a hand for a moment? Today's the big day, isn't it? Oh, I'm so nervous I could cry, Adiza. <laughs> Come now, Freya. You'll do great, I'm sure of it. Arisa. Say, Adiza. Hmm? You've been so supportive all this time. I want to do something for you too, Adiza. So There's nothing for you to do, Freya. Ah, so what about your dream, Adiza? Anything we've done has been for me, and I feel... This is my dream, Freya. Running this shop won't make us wealthy, Adisa. What about several shops? Ha! Huh? You want to design clothes, Freya, not just work as a seamstress. Of course, but that's just a dream, Adisa. I'll prove it to you then. What? You'll be the best seamstress in Primaldor, Freya. And once we've achieved that, we'll have shops everywhere. Oh, Edisa, don't be silly. That's my dream, Freya. It's not silly. Your clothes will be worn across the entire country. You'll see. Look at you. That's all it takes to get you ready to beat. Oh, for goodness sake, Freya. Grape Jewel, ending number six. And that is the last one, right? Oh my god. <laughs> so... Hold on. Do I have a save file for uh, Edisa's house? Please tell me I do. Literally anything. Anything will... Uh... Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So now I have all the endings, right? Just to make sure I'm gonna check. I'm pretty sure I do because I got like three achievements at once, but... Mm. 
Yep, that's all of them. Oh, and I was kind of expecting it to do something, but guess not. Oh well, that's the end of the game.